Good morning, good morning. How are we all doing? Happy, happy Thursday morning. He says, clattering around in the background. How are you doing? Hi, Linnea. How are you? Hey, Reapus. You're one hour in front. It's nine o'clock, isn't it? Am I? What's going on? Did I do something wrong? Oh, I see. I see what you're saying. I see what's going on. I see what's going on. Uh, I don't know why your blurb didn't play it now. I should have done. There is a, a blurb thang for the starting screen. Um, I don't know. don't know what's going on there. Sorry. Sometimes sometimes it just doesn't work. Cooley struggles with the walk-ons quite a lot. If only there were some sort of sound effect you could use to uh, illustrate whether you find it acceptable or not that your walk-on didn't play. It's just, um, I don't I don't know how you feel about it. <laughs> I've not had coffee yet either, Reapers, but I'm on my second cup of tea. <laughs> Let's be happy. Yay! How are you both? Are you well? It's been very quiet for streams this week. It's very, very crazy. I mean, I know I've not had the normal number of streams, but uh, Rachel's streams have been really quiet as well. A couple of others too. I think everybody's all over doing exciting things. Getting out, being in the sunshine, licking each other's faces. All that kind of stuff. It's too warm to stream, yeah. It was pretty wretched on uh, on Tuesday. I'm hoping today will be alright, because it's, it's in the morning. But, uh... Whoa. We shall see. Oops, that's not what I wanted to do. Oh, crap. That's what I want. I'll chuck one of them down there. So, when I was last playing this, I didn't really understand what I was doing. And I remember that we were chucking pieces downstairs and what I was going to try was not keep going back and forth over and over again and to see if we can like make a bridge by chucking stuff down here instead see if that works that was the plan oops uh, currently fucking that plan up like just colossally I want a long piece, please. There we go. Uh, I don't want to sit there being a sweaty mess, right? It's the headphones that are the worst part. You get like a ring of sweat in your headphones. Blech. Very well, Mr. Neil. How are you and the missus? How come no stream on Monday? Uh, because Mrs. Before Me TV's mum and aunt are over to visit. Uh, and that was when they landed. So no stream while they uh, we got them into the hoose. Okay, but aren't I supposed to have longer pieces? Oh, right, sir. Uh, yeah, I need to do that. That's what I need to do. Oh, this is going to be easy. Look at that. I'm going to put that there. I'm not going to put that there. Here we are. I'm going to put that there. Uh, and yeah, and I cut my, my Tuesday one a bit short because it was just too fucking hot. Too much, man. Too much. Uh, fully vaccinated now. Nice. Good stuff. I'm, I'm due to get my second shot sometime next month. I think something the 8th or something of October. August. It's exciting. So that'll be good. I'm kind of, kind of a little bit sad at having to end my life as a hermit. It's been, it's been pretty good, to be honest with you. But, you know, it's what we have to do. Yeah, tell us, tell us all about. It. Have you played any more Reapers? Aha! That was the correct thing to do. I'm broken. 
only time I might play it, I'm not too sure about it, to be honest. Played all last night, this is such a lot to do. That's, that's an MMO for you. <laughs> right? <laughs> How's the combat? Is it, um, is it a bit more sort of real time and interactive and action y, or what are the class is like? All that kind of stuff. Oh no, our poor robot died. Oh. I reckon we can rebuild him. Yes, live, live. You don't have a class. Instead, it's based on choice of two weapons, which you level up, mastery, and select abilities for. Okay. I feel like that's some, something we've seen somewhere else not that long ago. What did we see that in? I suppose it's a little bit like Guild Wars. You had still like classes in Guild Wars, but it was still more based on the weapons you equipped. Oops. Uh, I think I might be making a dildo. Like one of those like mechanical ones. Oh no, it's okay. Well, maybe. Helicopter. I arrange for things like warhammer, sword, and board, muskets, and life staves. I want to be healers. A bit like Warframe in that respect, I guess. Okay. Nice try. <laughs> I mean, Warframe is still hugely dependent on the frames themselves. Hey, we found our son! Is this it? Is this the end of the game? We take her for again. Aww. Oh dear. That didn't go well. Okay, we're down here. That's okay. That's okay. Many grubs you can only play as human. Are there are there, are there other races in the game? Are, like non playable, or is it is it just all humans all the time? Uh what else we got then? Okay. Can we just rebuild it? Oh, he's building. Hundred percent human. Okay. I'll, I'll, I'll try it. Maybe if they do a free trial, but I can't be asked to buy it to try. I don't think I'm really... I'm built for MMOs anymore, you know? I think that kind of... that period of my life has kind of passed. I don't know, maybe something super special came along, but... I can't I can't feel like New World is, is, is that, like... groundbreakingly different, you know what I mean? Wrong, wrong way round now. 
Right into my immerse myself too deeply. Yeah, no, that's fair enough. I can understand that. Go this way around. Make it circular. Yeah. Is there is there much in a way of like narrative, or is it just a full sandboxy kind of thing? Is it theme parky? All that kind of stuff. What's what's it like? Because I've I've realised I just. I just can't be asked with full-on um, theme parky MMOs these days. It's, nah, it's, just, it's just not, not for me. That, that can't be the right place for that. What, what's going on here? Main story plus side quests. Okay. How is? I used to love these parts in uh, actual Lego, these little rocket pod things. I used to use them for everything. Is that it? What do you want from me? Uh -huh, that's what you want from me. RPG, main story and plus side quests. Lots of law books to find and not read. <laughs> Classic. I don't want that. Oh, let's put that one down first. There we go. I've got no idea what I'm building. It looks like some sort of vehicle, but I have no idea how that's going to work. No, is that is that not where it's supposed to go? a piece or something. Oh no, I, oh, I see. I can go on there. I see. And then we put the helicopter on it. Look at that. It's such a cute game, man. Um, good morning. Hello, Stephen. How you doing? You having a good day? How are, how are you, the hotties, ready to be even hotter? We're doing alright, thanks, Stephen. Doing alright. Bit warm, but yeah, nice. We just finished Lego, apparently. That's it, by the looks of things. End of the game. That was a super cute game. I loved that. A couple of little bits that were seemed unnecessarily difficult. felt like we weren't building stuff out of Lego, it felt like we were just like putting bricks down. Apart from the end, like this this felt like we were building a, a ship, right? It would have been nice if there was more of that, I think. Uh, I've definitely built it sideways though, look. Um, I think I think my steering wheel is supposed to be on the left. Um, but that's not what I did. <laughs> I'm good, got the AC on like a smug twat. Nice. Battery is getting raped. Oh dear. I was thinking with this game, why don't they make a sandbox type of thing where you can just build as much as you want? I mean, I would imagine mostly because that would mean having lots of pieces, and lots of pieces would mean that it would die on its ass, is my guess. Um, but I mean, there, there are there are Lego building games where you just build random stuff. That's that's a thing. Yeah, we finally get to finish our castle. Yeah. How cute. My Lego world. Oh, Lego world was terrible. But there, no, there are there are actual like. I mean, they're a bit dry because they're, they're supposedly for for actually making plans for the, the Lego stuff. But you can you can do proper builds and stuff on some bits of software. I mean, like I say, they're designed to to plan out your. Your Lego builds. What's this? We got more. Is this where we, this is where we started, isn't it? I think. Well, well, well. How the 
turntables. Turn Hi Ace, how you doing friend? How's your day going? Yeah, this is where we started. I love this, the way it uses the darker pieces, like, deeper on the on the beach, like it's, you know, um, seeping down through the sand. I think that's really fucking nice. Really lovely touch. I know that's a stupid thing to really like, but I do. And like, the, um, the spec maps on these as well are really nice. Like, they're, they're believable, it doesn't feel like somebody just dumped a spec map on them. It does actually feel like like a reasonable thing for them to look like. It's cool. That's a really nice, like really careful, loving details in this game. I'm really impressed with it. I just woke up having weird aches everywhere, but I'm getting my second shot today. Oh, nice, man. Everybody's getting their second shot. I'm so slow. I want mine. I so suppose it's not that long away. Growing pains. <laughs> Morning. I think that I think that's perfectly acceptable, Linnea. I don't know why I'm playing this again. There's something just satisfying about it. I like that this was basically the 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 theme of the last helicopter thing we built. I think that's really cute. We start and end at the same kind of thing. I should move over to Slime Rancher, really, because I've, I've clearly finished this game. He says, continuing regardless. <laughs> Growing pains when 28 makes me feel young. Nice. 28 is young. 28 is so young. I can't believe 28 feels as young as... It, like, 28 feels like you're kind of our age, like me and Rufus. That still feels like the kind of age we are, but we're not. We're definitely at the other end of 30 now. It's not good. I don't know whether Rebus feels the same, but it's, it's difficult moving on from 30. I guess once 40 hits, we'll feel it. Yeah, pushing 40, right? Fucking disgusting, pushing 40. Ugh. Why am I still playing this? Why Why am I doing this? I don't know. Right, we're going to, to Slime Rancher. We're, we're doing it. It's a cute game, but I finished it. I don't need to keep playing it. <laughs> that was uh, that was pretty brief. I'm sorry about that. Uh, uh, where the fuck is the thing gone? There it is. Slime Rancher, Ranch in the Slimes. Uh, where is it? It's on Game Pass, isn't it? So many game platforms now. Ugh. It's too much. Too much. Can't keep up. I'm waiting for the midlife crisis, right? It is depressing that we are genuinely middle age now, Rufus. It's like it's like hump day but not as exciting. It's way worse. <laughs> I can't remember what I was doing in this. I've got no idea. Something good, I'm sure. Growing old is mandatory but growing up is optional. You're right about that, Stephen. You're right. In my opinion, you feel younger. Interesting. Over halfway to drawing my pension. Both pounds of it. Good lord. Not that I'm bitter or anything. What is it now? 65, isn't it? Is it still 65? 
survive or do they put it up again? I don't know. These guys want parsnips. I think these guys wanted parsnip. Uh, not parsnips. Silver fucking carroty, whatever the fuck they are. Yeah, silver They are parsnips. Okay. Here you go. Have some silver parsnips. Enjoy. It's 68. 68 now. Classic. Fucking bastards. Like, I honestly, I just... What's the point in a pension? What's the fucking point? Because they're nothing. It's pathetic. All those fucking... I don't want to. I don't want to get angry about boomers, but the boomers got real fucking lucky with their pensions. Like they had some mishaps, but they had really good. Uh, the way pensions work is really good for that generation, uh, meaning that they're basically guaranteed and guaranteed to be pretty decent. Um, but they don't. Uh, they don't do that kind of pension anymore. The pension type has changed, which is super awesome. So we just get shitty pensions. Real nice, real fucking nice. Probably change before we get there. Yeah, no, absolutely. I'm kind of, I'm kind of looking forward to being a really shit employee somewhere. You know, at like 75, being completely in, unable to do anything, just tying up a job for that could be going to some young person that could actually do the job properly, hiding behind. Um, Um, age discrimination laws. It'll be great. Makes me laugh. All these people tell me I'm putting my money in a vintage tractors better than a pension. <laughs> uh, I'm thinking only if you come to sell them, people have money. <laughs> it's true, and still want them. Yeah. I guess always somebody will want them. But yeah, like pensions are not good, man. Oh, let's not let's not go down this road. I'd, let's let's be happy for a bit. Let's try. Did I unlock something for this? I can't remember. Nothing new. I'm gonna reply to a McDonald's when I'm old. Imagine an 80 year old lady flipping burgers. That'd be amazing. Yeah, do that. Oh, oh, oh heartbeats are useless. Okay. Uh, you can have them, I guess. Yeah, have a load of carrot as well. No good to me. Right. Let's do a round of picking up plots. I'll give you about tree fitty. Right. That's all it's going to be worth. Wait. Has that always been like a built structure there? Hmm, I guess so. I guess I'm just stupid. I am not. I am not a smart man. Hello, you little cuties. You little adorable little bastards. And a duck. Sorry for stealing your duck. Me too. Aren't you all adorable? Right, feed these fuckers. They've got plenty of food, but we'll just keep feeding them. Oh, they've got the rate of feeding is way, way up on these guys. That's not right. Sorry about that, chaps. Getting overfed. Have we got anything nice planned for the rest of the week? Good going on. It's supposed to be rainy tomorrow. That'll be nice.
Hey, we've got to do our, our little daily racy things as well, haven't we? There's so much to do, man. Oh yeah, I didn't mean to put the water ones in there. Oh well, I did it. I did it anyway. I'm a fool. Alright. This is not a well laid out farm at all. I've made, I've made I've made a huge mistake, Michael. How how's work? Is work nice? I went for I went for a ride yesterday with a friend that I've not seen for a while. That was nice. All masked up, obviously. But we have to do uh, testing on our visitors. Uh, to make sure they haven't got COVID so they can come out of quarantine after, I think it's five days now, I can't remember. Um, but you have to use specific tests, uh, and they only accept putting those tests in specific drop boxes, and they're not exactly close by. Nethbite, thank you so much for the follow. Very, very kind of you. Lovely to see you. Thank you so much. Uh, how are you doing today? Are you a Slime Rancher fan, Nev? Uh, but yeah, so this uh, these drop boxes for the tests uh, are miles away. And we don't drive. And they're at, like, uh, motorway service stations. So we had to persuade a friend to give us a lift. It's crazy, crazy talk. Uh, but they've been made redundant as well. This is the other Neil. He's been made redundant. Uh, nice chap. It's a shame. But he's also released a book uh, last year, and he's just about to finish his uh, the sequel to it. So he's kind of hoping that he's going to be able to break into writing books for a living, which would be amazing. Can you imagine that? Writing books for a living. So we're going to making it much harder than it already is, right? Like, nice assumption that, that everybody can get to motorway service stations. Uh, and I would be absolutely shocked to find out that the uh, this very specific company that I've never heard of before that requires you to use their particular brand of tests for the government uh, tracking purposes. I would be shocked, shocked to find out that that company was owned... Uh, by an MP or one of their friends, I would be oof. I could. I wouldn't be able to believe it. I. I would. That's a lie. Uh, I bet I've not played it before, but it looks interesting. It's super interesting, Nev. It's a really cool game. It's really chill and cute, and there's way more to do than you think there is. Um, it's shocking how much there is to to get on with. Hello, you little cutie. Go on, put it in. Yeah, you good. Good. Uh, yeah, super cute. Super cute game. Uh, I recommend it if you like this kind of chill farming kind of thing. It's got a little bit of sort of exploration to it as well, which is really nice. Um, yeah, so some of it's not explained particularly well. Like, there's a few, um, like, mini games that I didn't know even existed. Um... So some of it's a bit weird, but in general, yeah, super cute game. I'm just, just selling my plots, my week's worth of plots. God, they're no noisy buggers, aren't they? Calm down. Honestly. I don't really know what I'm going to do today. Um, I guess I'll do some more of the challenge things. Oh yeah, I need to do Moichi's challenge, because that's on a timer. So I need to do that whenever I can. The others you can do as much as you like, whenever you like. 
So yeah, they're not so uh, restrictive. Look at all those broads. Fucking hell, they're drowning in their own shit. Bless them. Did I already go and get the ones from the lab? Did I do that already? I can't remember. Oh, better go and check, and I? I can't remember if I did this or not. went up to to feed them. Did I take them? It looks like I probably did, but fuck it, let's take some more. Why not? Uh, what sort of thing do you normally like, uh, Nev? What sort of thing do you usually play? Also, what, what brought you here if you're not a slime rancher planet if you don't uh, play it rather if you don't mind me asking just having a look around seeing what's around I like the music man it's chill even when it goes all nasty when you get the grey slimes it's cute it's a cute game I still have that purple thing to do. Oh, the desert! I need to do the desert as well. Oh man, so much to do. So little time. Okay, that's turned off, so that's fine. Um, where was Moich's one? I can't remember where Moich's portal was. Is that in the lab? No, it's in the cave, isn't it? Moki, Moichi, I don't know. I don't know how her name's pronounced, to be honest with you. This one. Yeah, this is what we want. Uh, okay, we're quite a way off. What we need, but fuck it. Where are you, little buggers? I'll shoot you if you don't spawn. There they are. That's better. Stick to the left. So this is one of those mini games I was talking about. Uh, it's pretty cute. Uh, I'm not very good at this one. I'm not very good at any of the mini games actually. I don't know. I don't know why I would pretend otherwise. Oh, I've already got 34 seconds. Fuck it. Take it. Uh, so this one we just have to shoot these little grey things, basically. That's the crux of it. since I last saw you. I suppose it has been a while. What with uh, you working and me being lazy. What a combination. I 
uh, time's running out and we've got nowhere to get more time, so we're just gonna camp here and get them as they come to us. It's alright, it's alright, 99, that's pretty good. Better than normal. So what's going on, Rach? Are you working today again? Always work. Good type of good, nice. My eyes are itchy. <laughs> oh, I'm glad you're well. Oh, this is where I thought I was. Oh no. I think I'm a long way from where I should be. No work for me today, only our wee Connor. Nice. I mean, not nice for Connor, obviously. But I'm glad you're getting a day off. I hope I hope that it's slightly cool but still sunny, so you get to enjoy the weather without like melting and dying. That'd be nice. Wouldn't that be lovely? Chance to be a fine fucking thing, wouldn't it? Which way am I going? Then? Not this way. Oh, I've got no shooty things. Ow, no! That's not ideal. Oh man, I'm being a shit shot today. I can stick to the left. I'll go over this one. Yeah, let's go over this one. weather right now sunny a bit cool in the air oh lovely oh I love that somehow we've managed to keep it kind of all right in the house uh, over the last couple of days it's been been a bit sticky once it starts getting to the evening but we've been trying to keep the windows open in the morning and then shutting them as soon as the sun gets up and it starts getting hot uh, shutting all the curtains and just hiding away I think I fucked this. I think I fucked this bad. You know what I got yesterday? I got uh, I got Skyward Sword yesterday. So I was playing a bit of that. Looking forward to playing some of that this afternoon. Because normally I'd, I'd like to sit on my computer and like either fuck about uh, doing stuff in Photoshop or Blender or playing video games or whatever. But fuck that in this weather. It's too much, man. It's too much. Can't be having it. But uh, the switch is alright, because the switch doesn't make you all hot and sticky and. Ooh. So that's good. Yeah, good way of keeping it alright inside, yeah, right? It's a, f it's a weird thing to like accept, though, isn't it? I, I struggled with it for a little while. That actually, if it's hotter outside, all you're doing is letting heat in, and that your house that's good for keeping he heat in in the winter is just as effective at keeping heat out in the summer. So you kind of do the same things as you would do in the winter, really, once you've got the temperature you want. Weird, weird thing to get used to, but it does work. Like you, it gets really difficult when there's a breeze going, and you're just like, oh, but the airflow feels so good. Uh, but unless it's actually, you know, cool air, it's no good for you. Right, we're parking here. Go have a massacre. Ah, oh, no, I'm out of stuff. No! How can I massacre with those shooty things? Ah! Oh. I bet you got a heat from last week. Quite possibly, yeah. Our windows do not open, we have no curtains. I think I'm going to play some Animal Crossing in Minecraft. How do you both have no opening windows and no curtains? What the fuck? 
What kind of jail cell do you live in, Rach? What the fuck? Give me the airflow, I crave it. Right. Just need it. I need I need it. I need the air over my face. But yeah, that sounds like a a great idea, Rage. I did play a little bit of Mario Kart the other day before I got Skyward Sword. Uh, and I got really annoyed because I, I kept like getting second place on the last fucking race. It's like, I gotta go through it all again to get my stars. Uh. Well, that was successful. That was good. Right. Next one. Who's next? Let's go to the lab. Do that one next. I think I have to learn OBS Streamlabs to quit on me. Oh, really? What the fuck? What's it doing? Uh, I'm sure there was a teleport around here somewhere. Here? No. Oh, yes, in the, in the lab, isn't it? So this one's quite cute, I quite like this one. It's like a, a hunt the weird looking uh, slimes game, it's quite fun. Um, I'm on, st oh wait, wait uh, I'm on cold pewter for Ricky. I'm, I'm really against cold, uh, cold food. Like, seconds. Not a fan. Not for me. I mean, fair play, if it's what you like, but not partial myself. In fact, the only thing that I don't mind leftovers is uh, lasagna, weirdly. That's a weird one, look. These are the fuckers we're after. These guys with a dumb, like, face. They're imposters. They're the ones we want. And sometimes you'll see, like, items where they shouldn't be, and uh, stuff like that. They too are uh, imposters. We need to cut down. And it seems to me a good tactic is to fill your inventory slots and then just just keep sucking. Just suck endlessly. Just don't ever stop sucking. If you think if you think you've sucked enough, you haven't. Get right back in there and carry on sucking. That's my ethos. What's that? This is not a, a place in the real world. Uh, first it froze when I clicked on stuff, then it stopped to even start up. I've reinstalled five times. That's fucking weird. I've never heard of anything like that, uh, Ace. I, don't, I, don't, I have no idea what would even cause that, to be honest with you. That is bizarre. Big dumb boy. Um. Pizza is good though. Pizza with olive and red onions. Fair play. Again, not for me, but I'm happy you're happy. I don't know if he's afraid, is it? I made a paella last night. That was nice. King Braun Paella. It was delish. I liked it. 
But I'm cooking for four at the moment, and I'm not used to cooking for that many people. Okay, it was just the one. Uh, so yeah, I made a huge mess. There was just fucking paella all over the hole. Madness. Uh, thank you. Thank you, Ace. Thank you. I feel like I got another one brewing, so... Uh... Oh, look at that. Look at all them. I have ideas, so fixing OBS for music stream shouldn't be that hard, but I feel it won't look as nice with stream as with stream lamps. I mean, the, the, the result of OBS, from what I understand it, should be indistinguishable to, to, to our end. It's just, it's more of a ease of use thing, I think, as far as I understand. I've never used OBS, though. But from what I understand, because Streamlabs is, is OBS. It's like based on OBS. It's like a branch of OBS. Um, so under the hood, it's all, all very similar. This is my understanding. Hey, so, ABS. Hey, Apodiops. How you doing? I don't think I've ever seen you stream. When do you stream, Apodiops? So, hi, welcome in. How you doing? How, how's Australia? Still on fire? One of these has got to be another one, surely. There we go. That's a lot of nasties. Oh, I could have sworn I saw a rock up here that was shaking. I understand it's just got a bit of a smoother uh, UI here. Yeah. I'm doing okay. No, at the moment, too much COVID. Fair. Just currently set my stream. Oh, nice. That's exciting, Apo. What sort of stuff are you going to stream? I need someone to get someone to help me design some stuff. I can help if you want. Uh, and a look. Thanks so much for the, uh, the look, case. Much obliged. I've done my. Oh, hydrate. There's a big stretch. Thank you so much. A variety streamer. Nice. All the cool people are. Do you have any idea what you're going to start with? Uh, I would like that. Your stuff is pretty cool looking. So I, I, I have to preface that with the stuff that I did for myself. It took fucking ages. <laughs> Uh... Oh shit, no! Fucking bastards! If you 
you've got an idea of what you want, we can we can talk about it. I, w I won't make any like promises or anything, but uh, I'm certainly willing to help out. This exit, man. There it is. Okay, we got a hundred. That's all right. That'll do. Uh, probably Factorio X got nice. Nice. Uh, I don't mind a taking a usual discussion on compensation. Okay, yeah, cool. Also need a logo. Don't want to start before then. Fair, fair. Uh, unfortunately, I do have some other stuff on my plate that I need to get uh, through at the moment. So if you're looking to waiting to start, then I would probably not be any good to you. Uh, as much as I'd love to be. Uh, do you have any kind of ideas of what what you want it to look like? Any, anything, anything like that? Uh, need a COVID list so I can get a green screen from a guy. Fair, fair. And a mic boom, nice. Better chair and headset. Wow, you just want to get all the all the stuff first. <laughs> you got some stuff to do. Fair, fair. Okay, cool. Well, yeah, like uh, drop us a message on on Discord if you got some ideas of what you'd like. Uh, like I said, I do have a bit of a backlog at the moment with uh, stuff that I'm supposed to be doing for other people, and I'm being really shit at getting on with it. Um. But yeah. I can certainly help in a sort of consultancy role, if you want, for now. I don't mind doing that. But if, as far as actually producing stuff... Uh, yeah. You get it. You get what I'm saying. You know what I'm saying, man. You know what I'm saying. Let's go down here. There's nothing, nothing unusual down here. Damn it. Be a little bugger. Yeah, nothing. Damn. Uh, as for looks, probably black, red, grey, abstract geometry. Okay, nice. Be easy if you see if you check the stream layouts. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No worries. Uh, that actually, that kind of brief sounds a lot easier as well. Uh, particularly easier than the shit that I did for mine. In my defence, the stuff that I did for mine was more more for my uh, to increase my understanding of Houdini than uh, to use as uh, visuals. Education was my primary, primary reason. Uh, it just coincided because it's, it's so difficult to learn stuff unless you've got like an objective. Do you know what I mean? So much easier when you know where you want to go. Your interest screen is amazing. Thanks, man. Thank you very much. I just wrapped my head around the green codex. Around green codex? Sorry, I don't understand. It's not. So, it's not so much about having a blah idea. It's just trying to. If you're trying to learn a bit of software and it's just like, oh, my only objective is to learn. It's so difficult. Whereas if you're like, I want to make this particular effect. Um. Or, you know, I want to produce a thing for this, or for that, or I want to make, you know, whatever. It suddenly becomes so much easier to actually get it done. Because you've got, you've got an objective, you've got a problem to solve, rather than just some nebulous idea that you want to be better at the thing. Oh, green screen stuff. That's not too hard, really. Um, the, the biggest key, or, well, at least from my industry experience of, of green screening, the biggest, which may, may be different, 
Um, the biggest thing about green screening is making sure you get a nice flat lighting on it. So lighting the screen is the is the biggest deal. So you're trying to basically ensure that your green screen on your camera is as few shades of green as possible, effectively. Uh, makes life a lot easier. But all the auto keying stuff uh, going around these days is pretty freaking impressive. Um, considering how long we'd have to, you know, sit there manually keying stuff, it's uh, yeah, it's pretty pretty wild. I'm impressed with it anyway. Think about an avatar like mocap stuff. Yeah, no, that'd be cool. I, I want to do a little brick for me for that as well. That's uh, that's a lot more complicated because you have to do full full on, uh, you know, rigs and stuff for like that. I mean, it's doable. It's just effort. But yeah, again, that's um, that's something I could definitely help you with if you want. I've been I've been putting off for ages. I've been meaning to upgrade my vanille hair using the same kind of idea. Just haven't got around to it. Maybe one day. Maybe one day I'll get around to it. It's a lot harder for doing stuff for myself because I'm the client at that point and I just don't really care. <laughs> it's alright when there's somebody else that wants something and it's like Shit, I'm, gonna, I'm, I'm letting this person down by not doing it. How many have we got? 70. Not that many. Uh, then I also have to set up a Discord on Twitter and Facebook and YouTube. I've only got a Discord. I don't have a, a Neil Before Me TV, Facebook or YouTube or Twitter. Actually, I think I think I have the Twitter. I just don't think I've done anything with it. I think I just uh, camped on the name, I believe. Uh, yeah, I should probably look into that sort of stuff as well. Trying to do the marketing bollocks. To be honest, all that kind of stuff, I would I would say it's probably it's just worth waiting. It takes a long time to get started. Have you have you done streaming before, or are you is this are you going back to streaming, or is this your first first foray? Because it takes a long time to build up like your network and your. Um, you know, your regular followership and stuff like that. I mean, obviously some people do it faster than others. I was I was pretty slow, I think, even by average standards. Um, but that does mean that you've got plenty of time to worry about things like Discord and, and YouTube and stuff like that. It's not something you need day one by any stretch. Bit of an idea what I'm doing because I've helped other people. Fair, fair. That makes sense. That's exciting though. Well, it annoys me. I've got a few uh, followers from Oz, which are really lovely people, but I rarely get to, to see any of their streams because just the, the times just don't work out. It makes me really sad. I'd like to be able to watch them, but. There we go. So, when's when's like your, your plan? When are you sort of scheduling yourself to, to start? Just wake up super early. Yeah, that's true. I mean, I, I'm not generally. I'm not uh, not a late sleeper. I'm normally up and up and about by sort of six o'clock. Sometimes a bit earlier than that. But even so, it seems like I'm, I'm too late. Always too late. That's my trouble. Uh oh. Uh -oh. Uh, no, should do it because I have so much I need to do. Don't don't fall into that trap though. I uh, it's a really common trap I think of, of feeling like you have to get everything sorted before you start streaming, and it's not really true. Like you can start streaming with a shit camera and you know a mic. I mean for fuck's sake, I started streaming on the PlayStation. I didn't I didn't even have a camera. I didn't even have a PC to stream on when I started. Uh, there's just n there's nothing stopping you though. Like the the idea that it's all about the gear is is it's really tempting to be like, oh I need all this stuff before I can do it, but you don't. It's much better to just get started, in my opinion. But obviously, you know, 
your results for me. What do you mean you hit me? You fucking hit me. Fuck you. Oh, do I get hit if I go into the, the portals as well? Uh, it all begins to make sense. I'm an idiot. Who'd have thunk it? I'm the bit of a third dummy. Oof. We found all the things in here. Okay. Dirty. Let's uh, let's take our ill-gotten gains and get the fudge out of here. Where am I going? Do I see an arrow this way? That way. That way. Okay. What? Where? Oh, it's over there. Fuck. September, nice. I'm really not streaming before I get my green to hide my background. Yeah, no, that's fair. That's fair. Like, I, that's. I'm not. I'm not saying you should just like just do it. Like, obviously, there are some you know deal breakers, aren't there? Um, what I'm saying is, don't don't wait until you've got all the things. Do you know what I mean? Because there's always going to be something more to do anyway. Okay, I'm going to do one more of these. Just one more. Don't get me wrong. Yeah, no, no worries. I'm excited. I'm excited to see you stream. I hopefully see you stream. suck button. You know, is it worth just keeping it held down at all times? That one at the back's got to be a... Yeah. Come on! Okay, that was good. I uh, also look forward to joining the network of streamers so we can support each other. Yeah, yeah, it's fun. It's nice. Uh, it's 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 really lovely, like organically building like an actual community for yourself. It's really fucking lush. I've said it so many times, but I really really love uh, a lot of the guys that I've I've met here. Um, so supportive. It's, such, it's just such lovely people. It's it's a really nice way of like you know making friends and. It's what I don't understand with this all this idea of, of buying your follows and stuff. You miss out on all that if you do that. It's like, it's hollow and meaningless, do you know what I mean? Just like the rest of life. <laughs> Oof, ow. What have we got? Anybody? Any? I'm not gonna lie, buying follows is tempting just to get going, but I don't like the energy. It's yeah, it's no it's no point, dude. It's just no point. Um it's it's like a false economy really. Uh the thing that most people struggle on, I think, is the average viewers, and it's killer. Uh it's it's such a depressing thing to go through. But you just gotta keep going. Cause you have to have is it three average, I think? See, I don't, I don't even know anymore, because once you're affiliate, it, it's meaningless. It, it doesn't matter at all anymore once you're affiliate. Um, but yeah, I think, it's, I think you've got to get an average of three uh, viewers. As in concurrent viewers. Uh, so, for quite a lot of the time, you're sat there with like one or two people watching, and you're like... I don't. Is, is it going to get better than this? Should I keep keep on going for the hope that I'm going to get more viewers, or should I quit now because uh, it's bringing my averages down? You know what I mean? It's uh, yeah, it's horrible, horrible. 
and you're scrabbling trying desperately to get the follows and and then affiliate hits and you just don't give a shit anymore it's all just meaningless that's the best thing about affiliate it's just not caring anymore like you've got it partner's so far away it may as well not exist Uh, not gonna lie, oh, sorry, I read that. The rep you get from being a follower by is negative two, right? Yeah, I imagine so. I can only assume that's why why we get like follow bots dumping. I don't, I don't understand that. We had that last week. We had um, we had like two hundred uh, followers from a bot just dumped on me. And luckily there are some tools that you can use to remove them. Um, as a streamer, it doesn't make any difference to you. Like if I if I'm the the victim of a uh, follow bot, it, it's it's. Um, there's no way I'm going to get punished for it because I didn't do anything wrong. Um, and there's, there's quite explicit about that in the Twitch guidelines. Um, but still, I don't I don't want 200 extra followers that I didn't earn, so it's um, it's nice to remove them. But I, d I don't understand the motivation of it because you can't you can't follow bot to make like a, as a a troll thing because it, it it doesn't hurt me. Um, you don't get anything out of it because I'm not paying for bots follows. Even even if I did want the follows, I wouldn't be paying for them because I've already got them. Do you know what I mean? It's a really odd thing. I don't I don't understand what the motivation is at all. I mean, it it clogs up your streamlabs for a bit with all the notifications, but you can just turn it off and back on again, and everything's fine. Uh, can I get a couple of people to uh, keep this? Yeah, no, totally. That's exactly what you need to do. Uh, so Linnea was, was, did that for me. Uh, we had a couple of other friends. Mrs. Formy TV did it as well. Um, just let them look. One thing to note, uh, if you if you mute the um, if you mute the video, as in the actual stream, you don't count as a follower anymore. But if you mute the tab, it's fine. You'll, you'll keep counting as a follower. Uh, that's a little little tricksy. If you're if you want to do a lurk, if you're lurking and you mute the stream, you're you're not contributing anymore. If you know what I mean. Hey man, you're right, Felix Faber. How you doing? Welcome, welcome. How is your day going? Sorry, I, w I was not reading chat there for a second. I was uh, just getting off on a little diatribe. Hey, thanks so much for the follow, dude. So kind of you. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. I hope you're having a lovely day. I didn't before. I didn't care what sort of day you were having before, but now, now you've put down that little follow, suddenly I'm interested. <laughs> Advertisement money? But, but for who? Like, I don't understand. Because it's not like I'm going to go through and... <laughs> Thanks for the applause. It's not like I'm going to go through, through and, like, follow for follow 200 fucking people from a bot, do you know what I mean? And, like, generally, I wouldn't do follow for follow anyway. Because, again, it's just... It's just icky. How do I mute the tab? It depends on what browser you're using. If you uh, generally, if you just right-click on the tab, uh, there's a mute option there. <laughs> you enjoying those sound effects, Felix? Nice. <laughs> I hate hearing double. Yeah, yeah, totally. So I've got um, I've got two two tabs of my own stream going on on one of my monitors, and they're they're muted. But on those, it doesn't matter if I actually mute the stream, because it doesn't matter if I'm trying to count as a follower to myself, do you know what I mean? That's not going to work anyway, I assume. Um, but yeah, I know what you mean. Follow for follow is pretty disgusting to think about. Yeah, I mean, I can, the trouble is, I can kind of get it as well when you're starting out, because... <sighs> Like in a, in a kind of near naive kind of way, it feels like a nice way to kind of network and support each other. But what actually happens is nobody ever views each other. It's just literally the follow. And it's just, like I say, getting the follows isn't the hard part. Like, it's not easy, but it's not the hard part. Uh, I'll be joining my walk on in two hours and 49 minutes. <laughs> nice. <laughs> so yeah, if, you, if you're a sub, you get to have a, a walk on sound that you can use, which is exciting. Oh, we got a new thing in Streamlabs. What's that? Highlighter. What does that do? Capture and replay. Ugh. How about how about no? How about we don't do that. How about we go back to my normal thing? Shit, where is it? Where's it gone? That's not the right button. Fuck, where's it gone? <laughs> no! Wrong button! Oh god, I'm useless.
There we go. I found it. I found it. It's all good. I fixed it. Uh, follow for follow is unacceptable. It's like uh, follow for follow on Tumblr or Instagram. Yeah, like I kind of. It seems like a nice thing, but a fellow lemon grab. <laughs> Hmm, something is not right. Not, not right at all. The simulation I have been running to predict your performance on this project is not matching your results at all. How is this possible? I rely on my simulations for everything, and they have always made my life easier. But what if they're wrong? What if... What if some other element exists that even I can't simulate? I would need to create an entirely new formula to compensate for this finding. And what would that mean for my previous simulations? All the experiences and people I've passed on, because I need to think on this. I've added my advanced drone blueprint to your lab. You should prove very useful to you according to my calculations. Well, I hope so at least. Now I need to think on this right away. And please collect more map reports in the simulation. I am very close to isolating the source of the part that is responsible for producing the glitch drives. In return, I will prepare a substantial reward for you. Run diagnostics on simulation 392296. Username B. Humphreys. Password Morph. I'm sorry, I slipped into my work again without saying goodbye. Looking forward to your results. Goodbye. Lovely. What a nice chap. I will use my sound sword now. <laughs> We've got 600 for the next thing. What's the... Ooh, what's the next thing? What is it? Oh, do we gain access to this place? Ooh, I'm tempted. 600 is a lot of effort, though. Let's move on to something else. I can't remember what manifold cubes are for. What are manifold cubes for? Is it a building material? <laughs> yeah, into the refinery. Not very many. Oh wait, did I did I pick them up from the I did, I didn't get very many at all. Tight bastard. Okay, let's go and do the other one. So we've got the hunting for fruit one to do as well. And then, uh, the f I don't know. Oh shit, I need to do this as well. Uh, where did I put them? There they are. Hey, yeah! Uh, I want a one of these. Refinery link, please. Ooh, new things. Silky sand. Where was the last one? Where did I put it? I put it over the other side, I think, didn't I? Yeah, over there, look. I see it, I see it. I see you, baby. Chicken and beet. Pepper jam. Woo. That sounds lovely. Pick you up. And away we go. Uh, what was I doing? Oh, yeah. Fruit honey boy. That's what I want to do. How was the mother-in-law before me TV anyway? Was it an emotional reunion? Yeah, it was a it was a strange one because obviously, like, we have to worry about them getting off the plane and stuff like that. So, so Lena's basically just thrown herself in as being part of their quarantine because the thought of them quarantining for five days and not being able to hug each other was complete nonsense. So she got dressed up in a boiler suit and a mask and everything to give them a hug as soon as they arrived, and then bundled them all through the shower. Uh, and then sort of as normal so it wasn't quite the sort of uh, yeah it wasn't quite so emotional just because of all those extra steps sort of thing but yeah it's nice I think they're both really happy which is really lovely to see I think they're getting a little bit tired of um, a little bit tired of the quarantine now but uh, it is what it is it's better than not seeing each other at all right so 
Gotta, gotta take what you can. I've still never seen these fucking mud balls that they keep talking about. At least I don't think I have, anyway. But this hot weather is laughable to her. Not at all. It's, uh, it's hotter here than it is in Mexico at the moment. Um, and also, like... Because because hot weather is kind of normal in Mexico, Mexican houses are, are, are built to deal with it. You know, it's all all tiles and all about the airflow and all that kind of stuff. All their their windows are kind of you know screened off to um, allow for sort of you know heat exchange and all this sort of stuff. Ow, you little fuck! But yeah, I mean. Um, it, a couple of months ago is kind of when the peak heat is in, in Mexico, um, but it's 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 much more consistent because because they're equ equatorial. Um, it, they don't have such big shifts in seasons like we do here. It gets it does get colder in winter, but it's 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 not such a massive shift. Like at the coldest of their coldest sort of cold waves, as it were. Let me say cold again. Um, you know they're talking about maybe minus one or two. Uh, which is obviously hell for them because they've got they've got no way to deal with the heat. They don't have radiators or anything like that, um, and their their houses are really good at shedding heat, so they can't even keep them warm in when they do get it. They just have to sort of huddle up and hope for the best. Um, but yeah, because their days don't really change length through the season, um, and because they're equatorial, it's not a, such a massive difference. Caught it. Uh, oh, where I'm going now, then? What's up, Neil Gaming? Radiator Street Pog. You right, David? How are you doing? I haven't seen you around these parts for a while. What's up, man? You're not. You're not doing a sleep. What's occurring? I didn't know she were back to being a howdy again. What happened there? Yep, ruining my sleep schedule. Nice, nice. Classic. Sleep schedules are for cowards anyway. <laughs> uh, finally, been six months since the name change, so howdy just got recycled a few hours ago. Nice. Nice. Glad to see you back. It was it was very confusing for me. I'm I know I'm not a smart man, but oh boy, oh boy, it confused me. I've still I've never seen these fucking mud piles that they're talking about. I'm supposed to have mud piles that I can put into these little things. I've never seen them. I don't know whether I have seen them and I just don't know it. Do you know what I mean? I don't know what they look like. Just watch Midsummer. That movie is interesting. I've not seen it. That's like a sort of psychologically sort of horror-y kind of thing, right? Yeah, yeah. I quite like to watch that. I want to watch the Mads Michelson one as well. The, the what's it called? Is it called Drunk? Something like that. The one where they like decide that life's better when you're drunk. They just try and stay drunk for ages. Oh shit, that was close. Ow. Still not seen these mud piles. They look like. I, I assumed that they'd be really obvious, but they're not. Not obvious at all.
take a nap. Cool off. I'm really shit at this. Oh, hello. Uh, game mode. Just crap at it. Glow rocks. Yay! So pleased that I've got glow rocks. How, how was I living without glowy rocks previously? <gasps> That's a thing I want. Did I get it? No, I didn't. Uh, have you played this one before, David? Is this, uh, is this a game you're familiar with? have my, my resident uh, slime writer experts here today. Played a bit never got really far. Mm, that's a shame because it, really, it does really open up. I thought it was it was really kind of uh, slow and limiting to start with but it really there's a lot to do. Um, they just they just managed to hide all the things that they're hard to do for some reason. I don't quite know why they do that. Okay, I wasn't expecting to be here. Okay. <laughs> I kind of hate this game mode, I've got to be honest. It's really slow. I still don't... Why are these fucking mud piles? You're not a mud pile. You're a naughty boy. Still waiting to be sacrificed by hot Swedish plants. <laughs> you, you little perv reapers. I mean, I'd be happy to sac be sacrificed by anybody, I reckon. It's just, you know, the sweet embrace of oblivion that I'm, I'm in for. Do you reckon I've got to feed the angry ones to make them do the mud balls? Do you reckon that's what it is? Should we try that? Uh, none of you guys are going to eat carrot though. It's not that I totally didn't like it, just not really my kind of game. Yeah, no, fair enough, fair enough. Uh, all games can't be all things to all people, can they? I, d I didn't think it was going to be my kind of game, I have to admit. Um, but I'm, yeah, I'm really enjoying it. Ow! Fucking fuck off! You fucking dick! Found catnip. Uh oh. <laughs> I take it your cat's a, uh, a catnip fan. Our cats, uh, when I had cats, uh, one of them didn't give a shit about catnip, and the other one loved it. Uh, it's really weird. And I think, I think it was the, I think it was um, Hendrix, the, the the normally fucking batshit insane one that uh, didn't give a shit, which is weird. I guess he was just too mental already, you know? Mind-altering uh, drugs don't affect you when you've got no mind to alter. Right, I think that's enough for now. Let's get these back. I think he's racing himself to see how fast he can get up and down the bed like a time trial. <laughs> Amazing. 
Oh, you're kidding me. You're kidding me. Fuck! Alright. Oh no, that's not what I wanted. We're doing this again. God damn it. Oops. Eat some shit. Have a Snickers. See if that makes any difference. Are you making mud balls now? You're not, are you? You're not doing shit. Unbelievable. up because I can't believe that I've done this so many times and never even seen a mud ball. It doesn't make sense. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. I'm gonna do a goo. I'm gonna google myself in your office if that's all right. Uh, mud ball slime rancher. I've just never seen one. I don't think they exist. When Slimepedia is not enough. Well, I, I know where it's supposed to be. I've just never seen one. They, they are literally just mud balls. They are exactly what you would expect they look like. I just I just never seen one, so I needed to like confirm that I'm expecting the right thing. Do you know what I mean? Just jumped on my keyboard. Nice, nice. Did you get it? It's trying to communicate. Uh oh. Uh, I had the same problem in a new world last night. I had to call 20 sheep for a quest. Took me an hour to find just three, so I gave up on that one. Ugh. Those things. Like, every MMO has that problem uh, in the early days. There's always some fucking spawn rate problem that makes a quest impossible. Guaranteed. So the, the quests are the same boring fare, then. Go here, kill 20 of something, come back to me. Go and speak to this guy. Nothing, nothing more interesting. But at the same time, I don't know. Maybe I'll watch them on stream at some point. Are you going to stream it? Or are you, are you back off the stream wagon again? just make sweet love to that noise. Yeah, we're gonna carry on in there. Ow! Fucking penis! I've been all over there, haven't I? I think. Uh-oh! close. Uh, yeah, kill so many of this, kill this guy, or bring me this resource or find such and such. There's a bunch of PvP quests I haven't been brave enough to venture into you just yet. Is it sort of free-form open-world PvP? How do they structure that? Because I'm, 
I'm not a big fan of PvP, generally speaking, but in some games I think it's been really fun. Most notably, I think I've talked about this before, but in um, Warhammer Age of Reckoning, the PvP in that was superb. So you could do particular PvP uh, area sort of things, like, you know, structured team-based PvP, which is pretty good fun. But they had these sort of roving bands of PvPers as well. And essentially, if you joined one of these bands, you were kind of flagged for PvP. But they couldn't just attack people willy-nilly. It was all it was all opt-in, which is, is how PvP should just be done by default. I don't understand why it isn't. Why it's not done like Star Wars Galaxies, where you just flick a flag and say, yes, I want to engage in PvP and then put some sort of restriction on changing that flag so that you can't just immediately hide away again. It just seems like a no-brainer to me, I don't know. I'm playing Armour 3 and I found a mod that adds pirate ships for that extra realistic military flavour. I couldn't get into Armour. I don't remember which one I played. I did play one of them, but that was years ago. Is this, is this still the same armor? Or have they been actually releasing different things? I remember it was, it was Dragon something. Was that armor? I want to say like Dragon Phoenix or something edgy like that. I honestly want to stream more, but the games are most interesting in playing. My PC struggles with so my stream quality sucks here. I'm turning the graphics down, nothing makes it far less enjoyable for me. And probably the viewers. I mean, the viewers probably not so much, I would suggest. Because uh, most of the time, you, as a, a viewer, you're watching through quite a small window anyway, right? Um, so I reckon that's probably not such a big deal. But yeah, it's nice to, nice to stream things that are pretty. Hey, gaming glasses, how you doing? Welcome in. How's your day going, my friend? I set up an OP where me and the boys invade NASA. <laughs> nice. <laughs> an OP and op is what you meant. I'm an idiot, I'm sorry. Uh, New World has to be if you flagging things, so you press U in towns to flag yourself, and 30 seconds after leaving town, you become attacked by the faction. Yeah, exactly. Perfect. Perfect sir. What I wouldn't want to see is something like in Conan, Age of... What was it called? Is it Age of Hyboria? No, that's the new one, isn't it? What was the old one called? I can't remember. That old Conan MMO years ago. Uh, that had awful PvP in it. It was just like, kill anyone, anywhere, anytime. So you'd obviously you just have high-ranking people just hanging out outside of like really popular low-level zones. Uh, quest zones, just waiting for people to murder. It was bullshit. Uh, if you flag for people while you're questing, get extra XP. That's a good idea. I like that, encouraging it without making it mandatory. That's a really good idea. Really smart, really simple. I like it. Big tick. It's a tick. Tick. With a T. Uh... Fuck it. There's a teleporter. Oh, what do you mean? Actually, I don't, I don't even want the tofu. Fuck it. Thanks so much for all those kookadomas! You're after a great start! The Miracle Limex uh, day developed for my current crops is now available in your garden upgrades! Miracle Mix prevents fruits and veggies from rotting. Don't worry, I make it with all natural materials. Good, healthy stuff. But I didn't always think this way. I used to run a huge company on Earth that made Insta-food. Quick, cheap meals made of nothing but chemicals and preservatives. We made billions. But we weren't making real food. Instead, our food engineers worked to design products. It wasn't right. So I came to the far, far range to grow my own wholesome food with my two hands. I wanted to leave my life on Earth behind. But enough about that. On to more Kukudobas. If you get me a bunch more, I'll give you the specs for a deluxe upgrade for your gardens. Get to it, Beatrix. I've got a new recipe here, and I need loads of Kukudoba to get it just right. la -de da Oh, but I hate it. Oh. Okay, I'm not doing it. I'm just, I'm just not doing it. These guys. How you doing, dearest? Dear? I'm all right. Uh, not too hot just yet. I can see. I can feel the temperatures rising. 
Uh, as you could say, it's getting hot in here. Unfortunately, I won't be taking off any clothes. I'm sorry. This guy looks like a melon, right? He is a bit of a melon. Bless him. Uh, it's a nice balance. So you get extra if you're flagged, but the added nuisance means non-stop PvP if you flag players aren't too heavily penalised either. Yeah, that's good. I think that's a really smart system. I'm, I'm shocked that nobody saw that before. Well, maybe they have, but it's been a while since I've been really involved in an MMO. Most nights nice, I'm streaming for just fate in my Discord server. You're all welcome to pop in and take a look at my good point. Oh, okay, I didn't realise that. How come you're doing it on Discord rather than actually streaming? Surely it's t it takes the same bandwidth. Um, let's wait for morning. Do I have enough money to buy the next 7Z reward? I do! Ultra Dash Boots, yes please! Master Gordo Snare, oh, I haven't built a Gordo Snare thing. Um, I need to try that. Oops, I want to sleep till morning as well. Uh, Slime Rancher Master has returned. You're right, Ratty, how you doing, bud? How's your day doing? Uh, we've done you. We haven't done anything for you. Best part of the rain, you hear all those cars and people? Yeah, no, I don't either. Uh, strawberries and two flame slimes. Interesting. Okay, well, some of that's easy. Some of that is more complex. Oh, yeah, we've got all great ease. No rotting veggies for us. Miracle mix. Let's get them done. I don't think I fed these guys last time, did I? I'm, ba I'm a bad slime owner person. Uh, how's the DIY going? It's blissfully on hold now. Now that uh, now that we have the visitors, uh, I don't need to be doing it, which is lush. Uh, but it went all right. Uh, so that stage is all kind of done. Once once they've gone again, I need to start. Um I need to do the bathroom door now. Hopefully, won't need to do too much repainting. It'll just be touch-ups. But we've got a new, so we've changed all the hardware, so all the handles and stuff. Um, to black hardware, but unfortunately, the only black bathroom handles we could get didn't have the same size fitting as. Is this the right way around? Uh, as the one we've got, so I need to cut a new hole for the actual locking thing. Yeah, that's pickle pears. Uh, so that's got to be done, but that's not too much work. And at the same time, I'll change the hinges over as well, so that'll be nice. That'll be like a full set. Uh, we've got to figure out some way of getting some sort of faux mantle pieces up as well. I haven't figured out the logistics of that yet. I'm scared to fuck it up, basically. It's, I know it's putting me off doing it. Two of those. It's been great. What about you? Ah, uh, yeah, it's been all right. Thanks, mate. Um, early, early in the day still. It's been very hot here recently. Just remove the doors and you won't need handles. I mean, it was like that for a long time. <laughs> We're finally getting back to putting doors on, which is, is actually really nice. It's really nice being able to shut doors, especially because uh, the way that our house is laid out, there's a lot of uh, a lot of the house is viewable through windows, so it's nice to be able to shut the doors rather than having to go through and close curtains and all that kind of stuff all the time. Uh, very pleasant. Is it two of these? No, it was five. Of course it was five of these. Now I brought two back. It's fine, obviously. How still once it's finished? I was. I need to post some more uh, pictures, actually. Um, I used to have a load of stuff going on Facebook of um, all my house progress. Uh, but it's been nearly two years since I posted anything on there, so I should probably get on with it. But uh, Ace was asking for some progress pics as well, ages ago. And I kept meaning to put some stuff at the doors on, and just never got around to it. So what I might do is, now that things are getting to the point where they're kind of finished, I might do some like before and after pics for Discord, maybe? Maybe. Uh, it'd be nice for me to see the progress we've made as well, you know? 
I think if OBS could pick it properly, that could do one as a system for once. That's, yeah, like, um, having too high a bitrate on OBS is, is going to fuck you. Because OBS is doing a huge amount of coding decoding. Uh, I don't know whether you noticed, but when you when you run commands through OBS, it's instant. But when you end your stream and stuff like that, there's like a four or five second delay. And I'm reasonably certain that's entirely because of the, uh, the coding of the video. And that's what eats up your CPU. So if you're trying to open, um, code at a really high bitrate, that effectively means more pixels being uh, encoded uh, in a short period of time, which means your CPU is more under burden, which makes your whole system slower. Uh, 6K is the max bitrate. 6K is way too high. 6K is way too high. That's that's insane. Like for a 1080 stream at uh, 60 frames a second, like 3, 4K is plenty. Um, like you'd have to be trying to get up to doing 4K at 60, which even 6K wouldn't be enough for. Um, 6K is perfect. I assume 60. It's way way too high a bit rate for 720. You don't need it. You don't need it. I read somewhere that 1060 is minimum graphics card reasonable for streaming. I'm running a 1050 Ti. Ah, fair enough. But your your GPU shouldn't be doing the coding. I think that's on your CPU. So that's that's a bit weird, Reapers. It should be your CPU that's doing that work. Uh, although I suppose GPUs could could take that burden. I guess you could set it up that way. But I think by default it's on CPU. Uh, I don't know what I'm doing. I'm just walking around in circles now. What was I doing? Ah, uh, yes, I need I need flamey boys. That's what I need. Ah, look at that! Perfect timing. Um. Where's the? Ugh. Uh, most people used to be used to be Okay, fair enough. Fair enough. I suppose that does stand to reason. GPUs are pretty, pretty smart, uh, powerful these days, aren't they? It's uh, difficult getting out of that old school way of thinking, I guess. Oh, okay. Fire's gone. I was going to look at stuff in the fucking... Ah, oh, god damn it. I remember what I was doing there. Where did I put it? There it is. Uh, Nvidia cards have a thing that goes... Yeah, no, you're right. You are right. You are right. Uh, I'm just old and stupid. But I guess you could try... If it's not already on CPU, you could try switching it to GPU, uh, CPU or vice versa. Oh yeah, I need the flame thing. I might just... I kind of want to sacrifice these guys. They're kind of useless. Um. Ah, fuck it. So we don't need to hit three roosters, so let's get rid of two of them, two of them, two of them, two of them. Feed them. Sorry guys. It's time for those chicken. More intense game, more piney. Yeah, that's true enough. I mean, not for encoding. Encoding's the same for everything. Uh, some of the, yeah, you know, that's much more dependent on the game than the encoder. Sorry, I see, what, I see what you're saying. I'm getting caught up. I'm not getting caught up. I'm getting lost. I'm being stupid. Right, to the laboratory! Uh, i5 3350p. Yeah, that's, um, that could cause you issues. So it's another one of those situations where, uh, 
uh, one of the few situations, rather, where my sevens actually start being useful. Because uh, the only thing I sevens are really much better for is for multi threading, as far as I'm aware. I don't know. It's been a long time since I've uh, really been involved in what's going on tech wise. So I'm probably operating with really outdated information. Oops. Did I already upgrade this? Yeah. Didn't upgrade this one though, did I? No. Alright! But yeah, it sounds like you could do with a, uh, a new PC, generally speaking. But yeah, like, it, it sounds like you could probably benefit from lowering some of your settings and not streaming such high res. Uh, it says it's going to replace a few components straight away. I've seen how many times. Oh, nice, nice. Or a capture card on the console, yeah, that's true. Well, the capture card won't do you any any good for streaming from PC. It just adds extra overhead, weirdly. So can I make one of those now? Hunter plots I need for that. Okay, cool. Portable. Oh, oh, that would be really useful. Deep run. I haven't got any of that. Advanced drone. What's the difference? Two tasks at once. Woo! Let's get some hunter jelly. Hunter jelly. Hunter plots rather. Yeah, if you're using the capture card to capture th from console, yes. What, but what I'm saying is you can't use the capture card to capture. Some people think that you can get a capture card to improve the performance of streaming from PC. And the opposite is true, is what I'm trying to say. I can stream intensive games on PS5, but I can't stream them on PC. Yeah, no, absolutely. PC gamer till I die. Why don't you want this chicken? Oh, because it's a toy. Duh. Give me your plots. Keyboard mouse into your PS4, you won't know the difference. <laughs> I I disagree with that. <laughs> Don't get me wrong, I I've got consoles as well, and I I like console gaming as well, but they're they're just different things, man. They're just different experiences. And in a straight up race, I'll take a PC over a console any day. going to make a big difference in here. At both gaming PC and consoles, it's the same gaming-wise. I, I, I feel it's a different experience, uh, Ray. Like, I don't know. I find, I find consoles is just a, a more chill experience, generally speaking. Uh, for me. Let's try that. Any more things I can build? Anything interesting? <laughs> Not really. Depends on your specs, mate. Plus, the OS is a huge difference. The OS is a huge difference here. Yeah. But, like, I can get things looking way nicer on PC than on console. And sometimes, like, yeah, just like having the ability to alt tab out or just use a mouse naturally or just be sat in a certain way is just it's just nicer. I I used my PC uh in my old flat I didn't have a place for a desk, so I had to have my PC um uh, what am I trying to say? Um 
behind my TV and I'd use my coffee table. So it was kind of like using the console as a, a PC and it was just an awful experience. I hated it. Um, but you know, swings and roundabouts, we're all different. Different strokes for different folks, all that stuff. is true as well, you know, like, it's, uh, get an Xbox controller and a, and a dongle and suddenly you got a console on your PC. Like, a lot of games that I've been playing, like Hellpoint, I've been playing with the controller rather than the keyboard and mouse. I think it really depends on the game what it's primarily been built for, more often than not. Like, some games you pick them up and it's just like, this was not made for a keyboard and mouse. Like, we were playing, uh, Remnant. Uh, and I just, I couldn't hack playing that with a keyboard and mouse, it just felt so wrong. But throw, throw a controller at it and it felt, it felt fine. Uh, my wife's lost 12 pounds in two weeks since she started doing Dark Club things. Super proud. That's an amazing Reapers, fucking hell. That's incredible. Uh, doing it in a healthy way, I hope. Uh, dongle controllers are Bluetooth now. Uh, I mean, they are. But the trouble is, if you stick a Bluetooth uh, card in a PC, you're putting a Bluetooth uh, receiver inside a massive Faraday cage, and they tend to not work very well. Uh, so, generally, your dongle is just a Bluetooth receiver. And also, desktop PCs don't, don't tend to come with uh, Bluetooth cards as standard very often. It's more on laptops. My mother one has Bluetooth. Mine does not. It's it's not a standard thing, weirdly. You'd think it would be by now, but it's uh, it's not, I don't think. At least that's my experience. I've got a dongle. Yeah, I've got, I've got a dongle for my uh, controller. And it's, it's literally just a, a Bluetooth USB Bluetooth receiver. Oh, fuck's sake. But like, um, I had I had a Bluetooth pair of headphones with this PC when I was at work, and like you had to put uh, um, the receiver at the front of the PC because you just couldn't get the signal through the, the bulk of the PC if you put it around the back. I had the same problem with um, with wireless keyboards in the past, and then you know, yeah, I don't I don't like taking up the the front USB ports either if I can avoid it. So having a bit of wire that I can plug in the back and sleep on my desk. Works for me. Whoever has Wi-Fi too, it's exciting. I don't I don't believe in Wi-Fi either. What, what's the point in having a Wi-Fi on a desktop PC? Oh shit, I was doing that, wasn't I? Bollocks! I forgot all about it. Get, oh fuck it, I'm just gonna sacrifice these two. They're crap anyway. We're going to get some more another time. Uh, excuse you. <laughs> we'll keep this filled with ash though. Just to take the piss. Uh, Wi-Fi cannot ever be as good as a wired connection, Ray. It just can't. It's just physically impossible. Wired connections will always be better than Wi-Fi. Purely because copper is a better conductor than air. My PC is nowhere near any theater port. Ugh. Rancid. Wired all the way whenever I can. Don't need a wired connection that great, yeah, unless you're an MOG 360 player. I don't, I don't know. Like faster connection is is better for all things, as far as I'm concerned. Uh, fast and reliable connection speed. Why would I not have it? I mean, like, yeah, fair enough. Don't get me wrong. Like, you you have a situation where you can't use a wired connection and you don't need a wired connection. Fair, fair play to you. Like, I'm not going to tell you you're doing it wrong, but I I couldn't live like that. 
Yeah, it's a nice to have, right? If you can, it's it's like it is just better. It just is, but it's it's not necessary that you need it that much better. If you see what I mean. If you can, if if the less good thing is good enough, then it's good enough. You don't always need to be chasing the most awesome thing you can. I think that's that's true of a lot of things. We don't need the best. Good enough is often the best option. Uh, it's not used to be noticeable unless you compare them side by side, but it is certainly faster. Yeah, and also like things like downloading patches and things like that. It's uh, it's noticeable. I could be sitting on the modem and I would still use Wi-Fi because I'm lazy. Oh, what? How? What? But it's just it's just a bit of string. You plug it in once and then you never have to think about it again. How is that? I don't understand. But okay, if you're happy, you're happy. That's all that matters. That's fast enough. Fair enough. Fair enough. <laughs> yeah, no, true, true. But that is that is extreme laziness for doing for doing it once. <laughs> I also use Wi-Fi. Weird. Weird. I'm not I'm not not okay with that, personally. I <laughs> get about 30 meg download. <laughs> not not quite so fancy. Uh I don't know what I'm doing, man. Uh uh. Oh yeah, I wanted to plop the Gordo thing out somewhere. Where's my teleporter? Let's do that. I'm just gonna do it out here. Yeah, I think it, they've done already. Uh, 50 oh, I put the market one down. I'm an idiot. I want the refinery link. That's what I wanted. Idiot. Uh, shit, where are we? I used to have 15 to we upgrade our internet, and I get 300. Mm, that's nice. We used to have gigabit at work. It was fucking amazing. Absolutely incredible. Uh, morning, morning, Lenia. How are you doing? How's it going? You having a good day? Nice to see you. You get some of the worst internet speeds in Europe. It does in some places, yeah. <laughs> Imagine dying in The Sims. Wow. Wow. Way to go there, Howdy. Jeez. <laughs> it couldn't be me. <laughs> right. I need some food for this thing. <laughs> I bet The Sims use Wi Fi. I gave this some food. That'll do. Put a hen hen in it. How do these work? What do they do? Uh, where is it? Over there. Actually, no. I don't want to do that. Oh, it's too late. Okay. Because that means I'm going to need to get some hen hens to feed whatever comes for it, doesn't it? I'm a little Wait. What? What? 
There's heads around here as well. Uh, nice to see you too. I've been suffering with neck pain, but I'll manage. Oh no, I'm sorry. That's not good. It's that sort of things always really take it out of you. Really difficult. So that looks like a water guy. So where's the... Where's the rest of them? Alright, let's go and get a, a plort. See if it is in fact what I think it is. Oh, I need to make some more refineries as well, don't I? Oh! Never ends. Life is a slant rancher. Busy, 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 busy. Sorry for the spoiler, but still get fucked. Jesus, howdy. Do you know Lenia? <laughs> Fucking hell. Let's let's be nice to people we don't know. Rock guy, pretty sure. Fair. I know my death. I just didn't watch it. I'm sorry. It was it was hard to watch, Lenia. It was hard to watch. Advanced apiary. Phosphor plots we need. Okay, uh, let's check what else we need. Tabby. And I'll do, I think. Phosphor and tabby plots. Not at all. I make terrible first impressions. <laughs> well, let's, let's, let's try not being aggressively nasty to people we don't know in chat. That would be real nice. Thanks, dude. No problem when you uh, when you know each other well enough to build up a rapport, but let's let's not open with those. <laughs> At least I'm not alone in the graveyard anymore. Hey man, there's two of me. <laughs> you you got brought to our graveyard. I've done yours. I haven't done Bob. Chickens, chickens. Love Bob. Stone, briar, and a rooster. Let's see what we got. Let's get rid of this as well. Is there a thing I want? I want a tabby, didn't I? God damn it. Okay, let's go and get the tabby plots first. Uh, I just realised now that you're talking about the Sims. Yeah. It was it was hard watching. I didn't like it. It went on for a long... It took you a long time to burn to death. <laughs> Very awkward watching. <laughs> it's a fucking genius idea though. Rachel stumbled onto something wonderful with this. How's uh, how's the weather in Ireland at the moment, uh, Lenia? Is it horrible? My condolences, by the way. <laughs> oh, it's gonna be build. Anything good? That's fucking useless. I don't understand the point of that. Fifty percent chance to double your chickens. What's the fucking point? What's the fucking point? Like the math on that is simple, right? Oh. I guess I can make some of this shit. Don't really want to though, what's the point? It just takes up slots that I could be filling with useful things. I guess eventually I'll have to. Right, what did he want? One of them. Oh no, our rooster's got old. Oh no, that's not ideal. Hopefully one of these will grow into a rooster. Okay, I've only got two stony hens. That's not ideal. Oh, I need one of those. Two stony hens and a rooster, so I need to go find a rooster and some stony hens. Um, sorry guys. Oh, no, before we do that... 
back down here. I feel like I've built all this stuff in really stupid spots. Oh, there we go. Uh, advanced drill, please. Advanced pump, please. Advanced apiary, please. Lovely. Leave them to it. Oh, look. Do I need a I don't need a henna. Uh, oh, and another thing I need to do. Oh, I've got. I just. I just get the improved run. Fucking hot, right? Not ideal. Uh, like I said to Rachel, next one needs more free loving, making more Love Island less under games. Yeah, I think, I think that could be interesting. I think. I think the trouble is with the way it's set up at the moment, like. It just it just gets through everything a little bit too fast. It's not not the suspense, you know. I'd like a little bit more suspense and a little bit less guaranteed death. But that's that's me. Like we all, we all want different things, right? Uh, every time Connor Rea sleeps with someone, they get eliminated. <laughs> Love it. I suppose you could have like competitions between two different houses as well. You could like alternate streams between them. Oh, and I hope you, uh, give me glasses. I hope, I hope you get a leg hair weirdly caught in the fabric of your jeans. That's what I hope for you. Rooster! You little prick! God damn it. Need to find a rooster and. Estonians? Estonians? What? Uh, I need to find a roosteroo and... Oh, stony hens! Sorry! Getcha, getcha! Yeah, stony hens, yeah. Fucking hell, that took, that took a little bit for my brain to do the mental gymnastics. <laughs> I'm not a smart man! Uh, stony hens are normally down here. Look, there's one. A yoink! I still need a rooster roo, though. Oh. Okay, that's weird. Um. No rooster. I, you know what I could do? I could steal the chicks. Hope that they turn into roosteroos sometime. That's a silly idea. That's a stupid idea. Because when you say stony hen, it sounds like you're saying, I need a stony hen. Yeah, I need a stony hen. I need a stony hen. It is like I am French. I need a stony hen. Oh, my no, these stony hens will not fit in my rucksack. Uh, it does make sense. It does make sense, gaming glasses. I get it. I get it. I wonder if I've got any roosters in my little little other area. I, want, I wonder if I've got any cocks in my other area. <laughs> On that note, <laughs> thanks, Sol. Hey, Sol, it feels like I've been ages since I've seen you. How are you doing, bud? You all right? I know I was a bit absent from a bit absent from everyone's stream uh, last week. <laughs> I was just saying I need a cock in my other area. Shiny. Uh, thank you so much for the sub, though. So, really, really kind of you. How long's it been? Eight months, six months straight. Good lord, that's mental, isn't it? How mad is that? Damn. What, what was I streaming when you first uh, showed up, so? Do you remember? I have, a, I have a sneaky suspicion it was Warframe. I'm not sure if that, that fits. 
Okay, okay. I think that's red. Oh, shit, wrong one. I think that's red floats. Yeah. Uh, maybe KSP. Oh, maybe, maybe. I don't think it was Warframe. Hmm. I don't know. It's hard to remember in these things, especially when you stream just random shit constantly. <laughs> I just completely willy nilly with no regard for any consistency. I don't remember. What was I streaming eight months ago? Oh, I don't need to warn you, you're not doing anything anyway. Oh, done that. Let's get these taken away. These guys should be back on carrots, really. Oh, don't feed them that often. Not necessary. Uh, but you're good. Hope you're good too. I'm all right as well. Thanks. Uh, thanks, so I'm doing all right. Uh, it's been a too bloody hot recently, but and we've got uh, we've got the in-laws down, so that's nice. Well, the in-law. <laughs> got uh, got the mother-in-law and. Uh, and an aunt. So that's quite nice. Uh, it's really nice for them to be able to see each other. They've not seen each other for like two years, I think, now. It's crazy. It's, uh, it's about bloody time. Stunning guys eat heartbeats. Yeah, but my stunning guys are merged with my pink guys. Oh, fuck. Idiot. Uh, and the pink guys eat anything, so... <sighs> Does it matter? I'd really like to be able to upgrade this shit at some point, that would be nice. initial double plots, but the if the pink one's favourite food is anything is it not is it not oh do they not have a favourite? Oh they have no favourite. Oh uh, okay. That does make sense. That's what I was doing. That's what I was doing before. That's what the beats were still there for. And then I just have loads of spare carrot. Just endless spare carrot. Um which would now launch into space. So wasteful. That does make sense. That explains why I kept the beats. Beats. I'm gonna have to go through this process literally every time. Because <laughs> I just keep forgetting. Hi Neil, back with food. Nice! What did you get, Rage? Speaking of, I might have to take a minute to go and get a cup of tea and nom some biscuits. I'm going a lot longer than normal without a tea break. Oh, I said it because you've done it last week too. Yeah, I think I've done it every time. <laughs> I think the frustration is because I need those odd radishes, right? And I have to grow carrots then. And it's like, I don't really want carrots. So it kind of makes sense to me to just feed the pink ones carrots to have somewhere for it to go and then save the space for something else. Up into the shower. Nice. Enjoy. Uh, thanks so much for the lurk, Gaming Glasses. Very kind of you. Right, I'm gonna I'm gonna empty these guys. I'm gonna drain these guys. And then we're gonna go. Where the fuck are you? Get back in there. Why have you mixed with crystals? The uh, the Raccoonie boys. Saw, in fact, it's the invisible hunter guys with the crystals. I figured because then I'm, I've got more chance of seeing them because they leave something physical around. So if they do get out, I'm more likely to see where the fuck they are. 
That was my cunning plan. Hello, Connor. How are you doing? How's work today? Yuck. Right. It's too many times. You've escaped too many times. You know what that means. Go for a swim. I don't know why he's starting to escape all the time. Left them toys and everything. I don't want Connor to go to work. I don't want Connor to go to work either. Connor should stay at home with us. Mucho gusto. Nice. That's some proper Spanish as well. Having uh, having Mrs. Before Me TV's mum and aunt here has highlighted how bad my Spanish has gotten. It was never good. It was always awful. But man, it's so bad now. I've forgotten so much stuff. I see the origin of duck face today. <laughs> what? Mucho bien. <laughs> uh, it would be Mucho Bueno, I think. It would be the, what we would actually say. Or oh, Muy Bueno. No, that's more... Oh, I don't fucking know. Muy Bien? Muy Bien. Fuck knows. I get so confused. There's so many things that sound the same, and I get so confuddled. I'm so bad. Bien is, is Spanish too, definitely. Muy bien is definitely a thing. But I think that's more like it's better sort of thing. I'm assuming that it might just be. Ooh. Thanks so much for the sub, Rachel. Thank you. Thank you so much. Very kind of you. Hello, Ansem. I don't know who you're talking to, but they're very lucky. <laughs> ah, ah. Uh, how is everyone? I'm doing all right. How are you? So much for the resub. I can't believe it's resub day already. Madness. No me Diga. Are you an anal virgin? Are you an anal virgin? Got some products. Well, I've got some products here. <laughs> Hello, other Rachel. Imagine being relegated to being other Rachel. I'm eating Skittles and starting to feel sick from eating too many. Oh, living the dream. Living the absolute dream. Don't pity him, Rachel. <laughs> That's the absolute high life. <laughs> It's already getting quite sticky. It's getting hot. I'm not loving it. On that note, I think I'm going to have to go and uh, have a nice cooling cup of tea. I need another sneeze as well. Really should know. <laughs> I love I love skills too. What's our favourite uh, flavour skill? I think I've asked this before. Because Ace came out with something insane like pineapple. I've said it before. I'll say it again. Green sweets are the best sweets. Lime, always lime. Apple's pretty good too. If it's green, it's gone. That's uh, that's my stance. Give me them greens. <laughs> my favourite flavour is a handful smashed into my face. 
Do you not do like two or three at a time to try and get interesting c c flavor combinations? Everyone's love red and purple. Yes, yellow and green are so good. Red and purple, they're good. Don't get me wrong. I like like them. They're dependable, but they don't they don't knock my socks off like a lime does. You know, lime's where it's at. Reds and purples are always, but they're a bit mellow. For me. I love them. Don't I like I love them. Orange, eh? Orange is always a mess sweet for me. Um, personally, it always feels like there's more orange than everything else as well, which is you know doubles down on the meh. Uh, we're not forgetting any, are we? That's all of them. Apple flavor sweets. Apple flavor sweets are so rare. They're so good. When we went to Denmark, we went to like the fairground in the middle of Copenhagen thing. Uh, and we got some sweets from there. And they were apple flavored boiled sweets with like a little pocket of salt in the middle. They were so good. So good. Unbe unbelievably good. Who thought putting salt in an apple sweet would be a tasty thing? Amazing. Amazing. Uh, Rachel bought desert flavored. Oh, sorry, dessert flavored fruit pastels. Oh, interesting. Apple crumble. Oh, I love a good apple crumble. What do, what, do we, what do we say about apple crumble versus apple pie? Like, if we're talking post dinner, proper in a bowl kind of pudding, I think I prefer a crumble personally. Crumble is better. Yeah, I think I agree. Try? What are you talking about? It's not try if A, you have delicious moist apple, and B, absolutely murder it in custard. Or ice cream. Either work. Come on, some sexy. I agree. I agree. Same apple goodness, tastier pastry uh, roll. Uh, banana flavor you get from sweets that taste nothing like banana is actually from everyone. It's the one banana fact everyone knows. <laughs> Desert. What? Desert. Say. Desert. Drop. I. Ah. Uh, I see. I see. There was too much conversation that went on in between. I get you. It's a good pun, Connor. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. It was it was ruined by other people chatting. That's that's my stance anyway. <laughs> right. I'm gonna go make a cup of tea. Uh, maybe I'll sneeze. Uh, I'll be back in like some indeterminate amount of time. Uh, yeah. I'm gonna stuff some biscuits in my face as well. They were a different colour as well, weren't they? Bananas, I think. I'll have a cup of tea if you want to get. Oh yeah, no worries, absolutely. What kind of tea do you fancy? We got regular, we got peachy tips, we got green, we got mint, we got chamomile, we got Earl Grey, we've got decaffeinated Earl Grey, we've got something else as well. What's the other one we've got? I said green, didn't I? I said mint. What's the other one? I don't know. Goth coffee, no worries. Just peachy tips will do me just fine. No worries at all. Coming right up. I will be back very soon. Catch you in a moment. Apple juice, no worries, mate. All for you. Ooh, ooh, I might have some too, actually. That sounds like a lovely idea. Anyway, back in a sec.
and we're back! How are we doing? Apple is indeed the perfect fruit. I love apples too. Uh, apple juice, infinitely superior to orange juice. Orange juice can get the fuck. I'm not a fan of orange juice. At all. <sighs> for, for real? Come on! I can never see the fucking fire, boys. never seem to show up. I don't know whether they show up in particular places or what. Um, yeah, I love Granny Smiths as well. I love Granny Smiths, but I can't eat them. They're, they're too acidic. Uh, they give me ulcers. I've, I've mentioned this several times. You guys are probably getting absolutely fucking sick of hearing it. Um, so I go with Jazz or uh, Pink Lady, generally, because they don't give me ulcers. But I would, I would generally, I would love to eat a, a Granny Smith if I could. That's what I'd be eating all the time. I have to go now. I love you all. Love you too, Connor. I have a great day at work. I hope it's not too hot and sticky, and I hope it goes. I hope you have just the right amount of work to be busy without feeling like you're overwhelmed. <laughs> you shit, Howdy. <laughs> Bless. Bless. That's not the thing that I thought it was. Uh, yes, one of those, please. Pepper Jam. Um. I'm not a big fan of pepper jam because it always happens when you most need to print something. <laughs> that that was excellent. Napsy <laughs> Napsy Trallet coming in for the awful joke. Thank you so much for the follow. I hope you're having a lovely, lovely day. Very, very kind of you. Uh, are you a, are you a slime rancher player? Uh, and thanks for the lurk, Rach. Go and snuggle your cornish. Your cornish snuggles. Yum, 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 yum. Give him a squeeze from me. Wow. Wow, gaming glasses. I won't tolerate that kind of language. Unbelievable. I can't believe you're coming in here with, with a fucking potty mouth like that. Unbelievable. I welcome you into my home, and that's the kind of bullshit you spell. Fuck's sake. <laughs> I am, of course, kidding. Uh, speaking of links, uh you guys feel if I were to spam uh, some advertising for a friend's book? Uh, he, he wrote a book about a year ago and he's just about to finish the sequel. Um, and it's quite a good book. It's not like, you know, it's not the most amazing thing in the world. It's his first book. Obviously, it's not going to be earth shatteringly good, but it's fun and it's different. Uh, and he's a good guy and he's just been made redundant as well. Uh, and his name's Neil and he hates people. So generally, uh, he ticks all of my boxes. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> don't turn this into a stream of lies! <laughs> Neil Gaiman. Sadly, I don't know Neil Gaiman. I would be really happy if I knew Neil Gaiman. Uh, I can't remember what the name of the bloody book is now. I, I beta read it and I can't, I can't remember what it's called. <laughs> I need to read it again as well because I've not read it since it came out. Um, I keep meaning to get around to it, but just haven't got around to it yet. Um, I want to know what he's changed and whether he, like, you know, took on any of the feedback and all that sort of stuff. Let's see if I can find it. Get you a link. Uh... 
There we go. Now let's see if uh, it's going to time me out for putting a link in. Nice. So that's the book on Goodreads. Uh, I should have sanitized that link actually. Hang on. Let me let me sanitize that link. Oh, I'm not allowed to delete my own message, so maybe I won't. But if you like sanitized links, there's a sanitized link for you. Uh, unbelievable. Can't believe I didn't wash my link. Uh, but yeah, it's a good book. It's like a, a sci-fi kind of book. Uh, it's really good. I liked it. It was a good, good read. It was really novel and different. Uh, it was good fun. So if you feel like showing him support uh, to, to that chap, uh, please do consider giving it a read. Uh, I would be much obliged. Have you got a link to the prequel? That is that is the first book. The the second one is not out yet. He's not finished it. Um, Bob, chicken, chickens. I don't know whether Bob is ever actually going to give me anything. I'm getting the feeling that Bob is never going to give me anything for doing these missions. Do you, want, do you want stony chickens? I've only got four stony chickens. Damn it. You can't have four stony chickens, Bob. You're gonna have to just live with three. You greedy little bastard. Nintendo Gamer, hey, I didn't see you say there. Sorry. Hi, how you doing? I'm doing all right. How are you? How's uh, is your ear still giving you shit? Sad times. I hope it's feeling better. Or are you still still off from work? Too warm though. Too warm, Alex. Too fucking warm. By like. Wide, wide margin. Uh, my ears cleared. I just have a head and say, "Oh shit, you've got headaches now." Oh, dude. Never rains, but it pours, eh? Two weeks signed off. Oh, fucking hell, man. Is that is that a related thing? Is that because of the the infection? No <laughs> more cocks in your ear holes. Don't you dare kink shame Nintendo gamer. It's only uh, Nintendo's gaming's disgusting, filthy tastes that keeps him coming back and saying nice things about me. Uh, prickle pear. Somebody likes prickle pears, don't they? Who likes prickle pears? Ugh, they're in the thing. Fuck off. Sounded from anxiety. Ah, oh, yeah, of course. Cool. Sorry, you did say. I'm, I'm sorry. That sucks, man. That really sucks. Oh, that improves things, though, right? Doesn't that make everything better? I hit a wall. Oh, dude, I'm sorry. Is there anything we can do to help? I'm not giving you a hand job. Just saying. Just, just saying that straight away. Reapers will. Seeing your face has made me happy, eh, you little flirt. <laughs> See, this is why I like Nintendo coming around. So sweet. Such a nice chap. <laughs> Don't want a hand job I can give you. <laughs> I mean, like, there's not really much argument against that, is there? Damn it. Hands are hand, right? Oh, it's going to be an awkward semi, you really should watch Neil at one. <laughs> shouldn't be awkward, Reefus, you should take pride in that semi. Flaunt it for all to see. <laughs> oh, by the pool. <laughs> uh, 
<laughs> okay, these guys are not doing it much. Hands are hands, right? Yeah. I mean, I imagine that Mrs. Before Me TV, she, she'd probably be a little upset. But, you know. Uh, Alright, I'm back. Say bye, Connor. Bye, Connor. I'm not saying bye to Connor. Connor shouldn't leave. Connor should stay. I'm not doing it. I'm not enabling this disgraceful going to work behaviour. Not having it. Not on my watch. <laughs> Only a little should be fun. Only a little? No, no, no. If you start, you've got to finish. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Jesus. You know what Arnold says. Come on. <laughs> Isn't cheating. <laughs> Which Arnold says this, Rufus? I need a surname. Ah. Uh, see, and you, you're just coming in here with all that filth like gaming glasses was. Jesus Christ. It's just too explicit, Nintendo. <laughs> wow, I, right? Just fucking mouth on that guy. <laughs> oh, you're only angry because you're hoping for some second-hand sympathy. <laughs> you're just trying to join the cause. any automation for it. There is automation, Rachel. There is automation, but it's a pain in the ass getting it started and it's not very good. Um, but there is some. There is, in fact, some automation. I mean, they <laughs> started this. It's true. That is entirely my fault. <laughs> also, kudos on the effort to wrestle chat back onto game topics, Rachel. <laughs> Herculean effort. Uh, warp tech, refinery link. Yes, please. Um, yeah, I've only, I've only got one thing automated and it's it's not particularly great. I've just unlocked a different auto automation thing that lets them do two tasks, which perhaps would be a little bit better. One would presume twice as good. Uh, but I've not played it yet, I've not got the resources. Quick <laughs> pickles. Uh, most games have the menu tasks become automated as you progress. I feel like this lacks it. Uh, I shall show you though, Rich. I shall show you. Um, I don't, because you might not have got, gotten this far in your, your playthrough yet. I don't know. I've not, I don't, I've not seen you play it recently, so I don't know whether you've abandoned or, or what. But you can get. These chaps, which you need to water once a day. Look how cute he is. And this guy has been told to pick up fire plots and sell them. Which he will very diligently do. I grab the fire plots, pick them up one by one. I'm a happy bee, 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 bee happy. Uh, and he'll go off and he'll, he'll deliver them. That's what he does. So there is some automation, but it's um, it's definitely a bit sluggish to get off the ground, that's for sure. Uh, my anxiety, Neil, anyway, bad. I keep stressing and even troubling uh, the gym, which is normal for me. Oh, really? Oh, shit. That sucks. So, because, like, exercise is normally quite a good release for people, right? And that's normally something that people do for to relieve the anxiety. That's horrible. I'm so sorry, Alex. Um, I hope it evens out at some point. Have you been managing to see your, your therapist 
at uh, last. The boy's very cute. He's very cute. I might have enough resources to get the bigger one. Let's see if I can get the bigger one. That would be good, wouldn't it? Trying to guilt Chris into making food. <laughs> Amazing. Have you read this book? I have. I beta read it. I've not read the book in that incarnation. Uh, so I read it as a beta reader. Beta reader? Beta reader. Uh, and it was good. Uh, and I left a load of notes and a load of other beta readers left some notes. Beta readers left some notes too. Uh, and then he had a, um, a more open uh, test reading thing as well. And I think he made some slight changes from that. Um, but when I read it, it was really good. It was it was really different. Um, when I read it, there were a couple of spots that were a bit bit slow, and it was a bit slow to get into at the start. Um, but I don't know whether he's changed that or not. Uh, but it was really fun. It was really fun. Really well written. I liked it anyway. I liked it. And I'm I'm not um, I'm not particularly uh, stingy about my enjoyment of books. If you know what I mean, like. It has to be pretty not me for me to actively unenjoy, not enjoy it. Unenjoy it. I'm a fucking idiot. Um, so yeah, yeah, I'd say, I'd say it's good. I'd say it's good. <laughs> You're a master beta reader. Thanks, man. <laughs> Alright, let's put another one of these guys down then. Another bee. Where's this bee gonna go? I guess he's gonna go here. Uh, one of them, advanced drone. Right, so your job, Mr. Drone, task one, you're going to get veggies from... Oh, so I can't, I can't define which veggies you're going to get. That's a bit of a problem. That's a bit of a problem. Okay, well, you've got fruit. Let's do that. Actually, let's let's get this guy doing the fruit. Fruit from outside plots and feed it to auto feeders. Okay, you can get fuck okay, it, get veggies from gardens and incinerate them. Then get. Fire plots from incinerators and sell them. I got this wrong, didn't I? Yeah, not outside plots. Gardens, please. And the middle of yours. Not fruit. Veggies. For fuck's sake. Veggies from gardens. Put them into water feeders. Do it. Nice. So hopefully that'll help keep these guys fed. Hopefully. I wonder if I can make another basic one. That would be good. Then I can get one to start selling them as well. Um, thanks for the lurk, Nintendo game. I hope, it, I hope things go well. It's your birthday soon. Oh, dude! Oh, I hope it's better for your birthday. I hope it's better for your birthday. Um, you don't deserve to feel shit, dude. You deserve to feel good. Because you're, you're a good guy. Worst things happen to the best people. It sucks. Uh, I played all of them. Oh, you talk about um, Leisure Suit Larry. Jesus. One of those on sale on Switch, and I've been threatened to get it. Oh, Jesus. Not to be confused with the multiplayer waifu game we were playing. Reefus, thank you so much for the sub. Thank you so much. Much appreciated. Seven months. Wow. Amazing. Thank you so much, dude. Really, really kind of you. Uh, I love it when you subscribe. Ah, stealing things from Alex. Ah. <laughs> That's what we do here. Um. Okay. That's a fruit. 
I thought Oka Oka was a fruit, not a vegetable. Oh no, that's a vegetable. Okay, that's cool then. Okay, that's not ideal. I don't really want to feed him. I'm just going to assume that I make enough vegetables to keep the uh, the incinerator going. This is this is hope for the best, shall we? Right, where next? Oh, we got loads of money. Let's sell some stuff. Ah, buy some stuff even. The other thing. Tank booster ultra. Oh, I need that in my life. Okay. Uh, I need some water. Oh, I just sold all my bloody water bottles, didn't I? Like an idiot. Yeet! <laughs> oh, in theory, I only need three. I think there's only three, three heads. Maybe I should let them, let them do another little poop. I'll get myself some of this. Huh? See it as we got it. parent is like. Poo! Get on with it! I'm so trendy with my yeetage. Yeah, man. Your, your, your slang is on fleek, my friend. There we go. It's the poop. Right. Let's go. read a book online or a uh, Kindle digitally. Oh, okay. I don't think he's done a print run for it, so I guess you won't be reading it. Because uh, he's obviously self-published. Uh, that's a shame. I, I really love uh, love the Kindle, to be honest with you. Um, it's been a long time since I've read anything physical. Um, I love, I love proper paper books, don't get me wrong. I do. Uh, but the convenience of a Kindle is just too great for me. Um, I do remember last time I, I did try and read a paper book. book. It took me ages to get the, uh, the finger contortion of how to hold a book right again. Because you know everybody's got their own weird fucking way of uh, holding books to keep the page spread and be comfortable. It took me ages to get it right again. Completely forgotten how to do it. You can buy the paper back. Uh, no, 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 okay. Right, time for next Sunday. Very, very kind of you. Thank you so much, Reapers. I really appreciate it. And I'm sure, uh, I'm sure Neil will as well. I do want to stress that this is actually a different Neil. I'm not, I'm not being cute. This is another Neil. Completely different person. Not me. I have written no books. I'd love to write a book, but I have written no books. Just, uh, just saying. <laughs> Can you get his wife, Sandra? <laughs> that confused me a minute because his wife's name is not Sandra. <laughs> uh, good one, though. Good wordplay. Okay, so that's not. I don't even know if that is a is a thing. Maybe it's a rock rock one. Who are we talking about? Neil, as a friend, who wrote a book. Yes, his name is Neil. Uh, he's written as uh, Neil Bullock. Oops. Uh, all right, I, I popped. 
to link in chat because I can do that. Gaming glasses, I can do that. <laughs> I'm allowed. Yes, I have a friend called Neil. He's another Neil, not this Neil, different Neil. Losing this bloody thing. Where is it? There. Mm, maybe a crystal one? I should, probably should have brought some more options. His real name isn't Neil Bullock. I mean. If it is or it isn't, I, I don't feel comfortable uh, telling random strangers on the internet, I'm afraid. That's, uh, that's up to Neil. Mosaic one though. I don't think it'll be another mosaic. Could be though. Could be. Who knows? We'll find out. We'll find out. I wonder if the bees know to feed them their favourite foods, whether they like prefer them, or whether it's completely random. Fuck's sake! There's a gordo up there. Fucking hell! How have I missed that all this time? Okay, it's neither of these either. What the fuck? How do we get these going then? How do I get up there? Oh, hello. Ruined desert blocks, yay. This cosmetic stuff pisses me off a little bit, I'm not going to lie. I don't want cosmetics, they take up the space of good things. I can't remember what they eat. What do they eat? Fruits. Okay, favourites are prickle pears. Oh, of course they are. Okay, um, well, before we go up there to see him, let's go and get some prickle pears, shall we? I mean, maybe it's a dervish. I don't know. I don't know. Very confusing. When you base rate, you just have to use on board instead of aboard. Is it still in the blurb on Amazon? Uh, what? Uh, you didn't have a blurb. I, did, I literally had the manuscript. So. But that does sound like a an un uh, un Neil mistake to make. I've got to be honest. When she finds a board, defies explanation. What's that? What's wrong with that? That's fine. I'm back! Didn't work out. My burn toast. Ah, oh, boo! I mean, Chrissy was a, a busy boy doing interviews and stuff yesterday. I suppose, I suppose he can be forgiven. Tits! 
Oh, I can just take them. Ah. Uh, don't mind me, you're just playing shopping mall parking lot. Shopping mall parking lot, what's that? That sounds amazing. As well, do you reckon? Go and have a look up there. Anyway. There's the end of that head. But what, what plots are we supposed to put in here? I tried water, I tried rock, I tried. Um, mosaic. I tried. Did I try crystal? I didn't try crystal in the end. Did I try crystal in the end? I think I tried crystal in the end. You right, fatty? Don't need coup berries. Uh, I like if you use the games on sale on Switch, and one is literally called Mall Parking Lot. Amazing. What? What do you do? What's it about? You can't just be dropping information like that without telling us more. Unleashed. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Uh, Eki was trying to persuade me to play some insane looking uh, waifu Diablo type game. I don't understand. I'm very confused by this. Blue crystals, right? So what flavour pissing? What do you want? Invading their infecting clothes. Good lord. Oh boy, to do the impossible feat of parking in a mall. This is really what video games are for. <laughs> Living your wildest dreams. Well, I've, de I've definitely tried rock. I'm sure I tried rock. It was definitely green. That's kind of purple. Don't think it's that. Oh, maybe it's. Oh, it could be phosphor. It could be phosphor. Um, yeah, let's try that. I didn't think about phosphor. Let's give it a go. Oh, I'm so confused. What else is there? I mean, that's too green, surely. It looks like a water one. I'm sure it's a water one. It looks so much like a water one.
I refuse to believe it's not a water water plot that they want. Uh, flying visit, just popping in to applaud your horrific pun in your stream title. Thanks so, thanks so much, man. It was a Lego uh, Slime Rancher double bill. Uh, I'm pretty proud. I shouldn't be, but I am. Thanks so much. I hope you're having a good day, uh, McCrudden. I hope you're having a good one. Uh, you better be. You better be. Why do I always like threaten people about having a good day? I don't know why that's a thing. I just it feels like. I I feel like it's not finished unless I threaten somebody. With a you better be. You know? Oh, itchy nose. Alright, I'm sure this isn't water plots. Like, I'm sure I tried water plots. And it wasn't having any of it. Unless I've got to do them in a certain order, but I don't think I do. I don't think I ever had to do it in an order before. You know what I do need to do? do need to get some of that uh, tasty upgrade. Oh shit, it's 60,000. I thought it was 50,000. No! I, I'm sure I tried this. It's not working, is it? It's just not having it. So why can't I open these? What am I doing wrong? Uh, I shall indeed have a good day, and it will now be good for you to have, have decreed it. Yes, it must happen. I hope you have a good day too. I hope so too. <laughs> McGrann. Thank you so much for stopping by. Really lovely to see you, even if it is a flying visit. Okay, this, this zone straight up pisses me off. I'm not going to lie. I've got no idea what I'm supposed to be doing anymore. And what's going on with this? Why, why don't I have a Gordo? Oh, maybe I'm supposed to use... Maybe it's not a plot that needs to go in there. Maybe it's something else. Let's try anything that's blue. Time to test out the pirate ships in armor. Nice. I hope it's fun. I hope it brings you the realistic modern combat experience you've been craving. Oh, we got Bad Wolf Howe. Hi, Bad Wolf Howe. How are you doing? Oh, woo. Thanks so much for stopping by. Lovely to see you. This isn't doing shit, is it? Um... Do I have to put one in there, do you think? Do I have to make it happen? You! You guys eat these things. Oh, well, I said howdy. I was making a joke. It was bad. I'm sorry. I thought you were talking about howdy as well! I, I, I saw purple and thought... I, I saw a high... Howdy, and I thought it—it uh, it was Connor saying hello to Howdy. <laughs> That's why I didn't register. I'm so sorry, Bad Wolf. I'm a big stupid. Hello, Nen. Yeah, he said, spitting tea. Hello, Nen Bonan. How are you doing? Uh, I'm stumped. I don't. I don't know what I'm supposed to put in these things. Um, it's not. It's not really doing anything for me. Let's go back and do another mocky thing. What else could it be? I tried phosphor. I tried water. I tried crystal. I tried mosaic. That's all the blue ones. Oh, that's not where I'm going. Um, oh yeah, and you said that uh, Chris says, hi, hi, hi Chris, sorry, I, did, I didn't mean to completely blank you, I got distracted. Uh, I hope you're doing well. I'm sorry, I'm sorry that your Twitch isn't working, even though you're somehow here. I'm very confused. It's 
time to do, 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 I'm not a big, um, big fan of sensations in general, I think. I'm not a big crisp eater, to be honest. Again, it comes down to ulcers, right? Eating sharp stuff never ends well. You say you're allergic to fruit. Me? I'm not allergic to fruit. What are you saying, Rach? Uh, Rachel. Because Rachel's not allergic to fruit either. They're just uh, not a big fan of veggies, I think. Me, hey, I'm not allergic to fruit at all. Uh, I said Granny Smiths give me ulcers, but that's because they're acidic. It's not an allergy. You know me too well. I try. I mean... What else am I supposed to do other than research my favourite streamer? All day, you know? And let's be face it, it's it's not like you're secretive about it. <laughs> you can have, yeah, no, I can have other apples. I can have, um... I can have citrus, yeah. Like, I, mean, t I don't tend to eat much citrus, because I just... It's, an, it's a high effort fruit. Uh, but yeah, I mean, I'll, you know, I have lemons and limes and oranges and anything. It's just, I don't know whether there's something specific about Granny Smiths, but um, and, like to be fair, it's it's not a you know confirmed thing. It just seems there's correlation there when I've been having uh, Granny Smiths. Um, I seem to break out in more ulcers. Uh, same with toothpaste. Uh, some toothpastes. I seem to have correlation. The tea I used to drink, there seemed to be some correlation there. Um, whether it's actually genuinely a correlation or whether it's all psychosomatic, who knows. But, having changed all of those things, my, uh, my ulcer situation is significantly better than it once was. Because I used to have, like, many ulcers at a time. Uh, and they used to get fucking huge. Oh shit, I fucked that up. Oh man. I really screwed that up. Oh well. So it goes. Which is the way out? Uh, one more is there to life, but people are bad at it. Exactly, exactly. It's all we all need. Pineapples are so good, painful. See, pineapples don't give me ulcers. You'd think they would. I mean, it must be something particular about the kind of acid, I guess. I don't know. Who knows? You don't eat the outer part of the pineapple. <laughs> uh, I got a bunch of horses at the moment. I had to stop them. Take had to stop taking the medication for my shoulder. I think that was causing it. Oh, really? Shit. I disagree that pineapples are good for my mouth ulcers. To be honest with you, uh, I, I see no correlation there. But you know, mouth ulcers are fucking weird. So what works for you may not be true for me. which is naturally anti-inflammatory. Okay. I mean, I'm not sure that that has anything to do with ulcers. Ulcers aren't inflamed. Ulcers are like lesions. Uh, I mean, I guess, yeah, I suppose it, uh, it could help for the pain, I guess. Because it would take down the swelling, I suppose. I don't know. I don't know. Never tried it. Maybe I will. I do, I do eat pineapple pizza quite wrong the reg, so, uh, although I don't tend to eat pizza when I've got ulcers, because tomatoes, that's bad for ulcers too. You have to eat pineapple though, rather than drink the juice. Okay. I'll give it a go next time, if I can stomach the pain. 
I mean, touch wood. Um, it's been much, much better over the last couple of years. I think the one that really did it, well, the two that really did it with the, with the tea and the, um, uh, the tea and the toothpaste. So a lot of, a lot of toothpastes have a chemical called sodium laurel sulfate in them for, as a, um, foaming agent. Um, and I think, I think that was doing it for a while. But there are very, very few, uh, toothpastes that don't have it. So it's a bit of a pain in the ass trying to find the right toothpaste. Uh, and the tea, I used to drink Lapsang Souchong, and there were some like really random couple of people on the internet, literally just like one or two humans in history sort of thing, uh, complaining about uh, apparently when they smoke the tea, uh, something in what they use to smoke the tea can be an irritant. Uh, so I stopped drinking Lapsang Souchong. I used to drink it as my main tea, so I'd have like, you know, five, six, ten cups of that a day. Um, and I stopped drinking it entirely and just started drinking normal tea, and it helped a lot. Like that was a that was a notable, like almost immediate effect. So that was cool. Uh, watching anime videos now, looking for the next Kaine. <laughs> it won't be long, I'm sure. It's never long till the next Kaine. I need to finish that. Fucking hell, I've forgotten all about that. I need to do the last last route at some point. I just can't quite be asked to go through Route D to get there. Oh god, I'm being a shit shot. Just as well I'm not playing Apex today. Trust in Reapers. Just don't ask my friend Dan if you should trust Reapers. <laughs> uh, these ships are absolutely wonderful model wise. Hopefully they work too. Amazing. Take us per day? Sure. Kind of be asked. Nice. Crushing it, Reapers. I mean, that's that's generally the upper limit, Bonin. Like, normally it's only about, about six. Ah, oh, that's not going to be quite enough, is it? That's frustrating. Nope. I'm going to be like 10 or something shy. Exactly 10 shy. Damn it. That was an accurate guess. Uh, waifu uncovered and near double feature into Alex Ubu. <laughs> Excellent stream idea. Oh, you want to see more near, do you, Reapers? Yeah, no worries. I, I, know, I know you love it. Good timing on the uh, sexy sax bone. And nothing sexier than this. We're at peak sexy. For sure. Bucks Fizz stream. What? Bucks Fizz? Thank god they included muskets too. This is absolutely amazing. I feel like a real Brit right now. <laughs> oh shit, it's full. Ah, have some extra. Oh yeah, I forgot they do that. I like the way they grab it from outside. Make them grab it. Wait, I'm confused. I thought I'd unlocked a bigger reservoir. Oh, do I have to buy that from somewhere else? God damn it. So much effort. Oh. oh, I should get some some of these on the go. I'm oh, gonna need more pink plots for that. Okay, I'll come back in a minute. 
Every one time someone redeems making your mind up, you have to remove an item. <laughs> <laughs> Showing my age. Yeah, you are you are a bit. You are a bit. That's alright. As long as that's all you're showing, Reapers. Oops. Oh yeah, I had no lot here. I'm just in here. I'm a silly, silly billy. Now we can have it. Let's have it! Ooh. So much to unlock. I hope you all right. Um I hope you have to pay play through tons of anime waifu uncovered simulator. Whatever the fuck it's called. Only to find out that it's all censored by blurs. That's what I hope. I hope you get all the pain and none of the payoff. <laughs> Nipple cam. I was the first. That's true. You are the first person to get your nipples out on camera out of this group. Amazing. and set sail to different heights. This is enough to bring a tear to my eye. That's good. I'm glad you're having fun, Howdy. I legally can't get my nipple out. As in, somebody somewhere has put a... a, a hold on it. You've been prohibited because your, your nipples are just too powerful. Photoshop some men's nipples over your nipples. Nice. If you present as a you can get your nipples out. That's fair. That's fair. Although that's um that's not up for the individual to decide how they present, is it, I guess? I guess that's why they use that language. It's not about what they uh, they would choose to be seen as. Subjective. I mean, I guess so. I, uh, maybe. We've also considered the paywall for these honkers. <laughs> um. That's quite an annoying noise after a while, isn't it, really? down. Ah, oh, shit. I didn't even fucking make them yet, did I? Idiot. <laughs> Imagine Scooby doing on those bad boys. Fucking hell, Reapers. <laughs> Jesus Christ. My boss, the absolute shagger, gave me next weekend off. Nice! What are you going to do with it? Plan. Anywhere 
house nearby that can plant things. We don't, do we? To there. Oh, that'd be a useful one. We can put the. Uh... Didn't I get the water thing? I guess I didn't. Good. Uh, I'm off tomorrow to witness a Year Six Leavers Assembler. Ugh. All day? What the fuck? What fresh hell is this? What did I come back here for? Hey. I remember. I remember. Uh, I want one of them. I need no deep brine. Okay. Okay. Fine, I guess. No idea the plan. Connor will definitely be working and see what Rachel's up to. Maybe a polite stream. Oh, nice! Nice! That's exciting. Love to see that. Absolutely love to see that. Uh, I was going to make something of this. I can't remember why or for what. <laughs> no idea. No idea. Can't remember. I might have to end my stream soon, I think. I'm getting I'm getting toasty. Well fucking said, Vernon, frankly. Couldn't have put it better myself. Birthday Crick's verified account. What? You what? You what? What are you chatting about? You fucking mag. It's not his birthday, but I gave him his present a week early because I have zero patience. Amazing. What did you get him? What did you get him? What's going on? What what day is it was Chris's birthday? <sighs> Amazing. It's my food uncovered deluxe. Amazing. Poor Timkins. No, don't pity them. I don't want to do it to anything either of you guys. Um, um, Oi, wake up. What are you snoozing about? Uh, is that what's over there? Don't know what his problem is. Uh, the prison I gave him earlier was a bento box lunchbox because he's taken nice lunches to work, and I felt bad him having them in a plastic bag. A bento box lunchbox. I need to look up what that is. Oh, nice. Nice. Very organised. I like that. I like that. Another trip to Chester Zoo. Amazing. I'd love to see his lunch fox. I've got some products. Oh, that's what I probably wanted to do. I probably wanted to put a market down here so that I can get him to feed and sell this shit as well. 
Wouldn't that be nice? Wouldn't it be nice? I want to see some fucking bats! I used to get bats in my back garden when I was growing up. It was lush. I liked it. Not so fun the couple of times when they flew into the house. Trying to catch a bat in the living room. Very tricky. You just kind of have to... You have to put like a waste paper bucket up in their path as they just do circuits. Just kind of catch them. It's hard. Just it was too expensive. I suppose it... Oh. How much does it cost? In Halloween, nice. Nice. A bit cooler then as well, right? Is Benny. 25 quid per person. Jeez. No, it's not as bad as it could be, but yeah, that's a, that's a bit much for a. Uh, one thing, isn't it? And on top of that, you've got all like the travel and the concessions and all that kind of stuff. I'm the friend who doesn't work. I feel that. I feel that. Weirdly, I can relate to that, Rachel. I really think I have no idea how to drive a 1600s boat. Well, first of all, Howdy, you can't call them a boat. That's your first mistake. They'll get really arsy with you if you call them boats. It's a ship! Student membership's 98 quid. That's much cheaper. Yeah. Don't spend that 25 quid, Rachel. Just, uh, just do the 98 instead. <laughs> so what's this? What's this insane assembly about, Reapers? my friends uh, are having their, um, uh, their kids going off to secondary school next year as well. It's mental. I can't believe I could have had a kid in this time. You know what it's like now? I don't! I have no idea, Reapers. The last uh, school leave assembly I ever saw was the one I was in. <laughs> Primary school graduation, prom, all sorts of... I mean, we had a prom in our day. It was shit, but we had one. It wasn't really, like, a big deal prom. It was just, like, everybody gets to go to the pub kind of thing. I think it was only for sixth form. That would make sense if it was only for sixth form. I think we had, like, a, you know, like a disco or something. That, some crap like that. Ooh, Miri. Bring in the sexy bag. Oof. Kids are lame. Yes, show them how it's done, Chris. I'm back. Guess who's back? Chrissy's back. I'm so triggered that my walk on is still on cooldown. How much longer is it on cooldown for? How you doing, Mary? Are you alright? How's your day going? We miss you. Just saying. Just saying. We miss you. 25 minutes, okay. So if I stream for another 20 minutes... Did you just ask how long? <laughs> I don't know, Rachel. Did I? <laughs> Amazing. Is it not on DVD? <gasps> Oof! So, Rachel, congratulations on the pregnancy. <laughs> oh, and apparently, uh, apparently Chris is pregnancy. <laughs> no fucking dickheads. Because it was such a dad joke. Jesus Christ. Keep up. The CD! DVD! Unbelievable. <laughs> what? <laughs> hmm? 
leaves. I get it. <laughs> it was a dad joke, but I didn't then make the link that Chris is a dad. I see, I see. It's it's too hot for thinking, to be fair. Like both ends of this situation. <laughs> Congrats on being Prego Congrats Big Boy. Congrats on being Prego Big Boy. <laughs> it's also Rachel's birthday. Oh, I hear. <laughs> Started up the shit today. <laughs> I didn't think that like nobody would get it. To be fair, I guess that's my bad. Please transfer me that one dollar, Neil. I'm gonna need it for the kid. <laughs> I'm skint. <laughs> I'll send you. Uh, I'll send you a car seat or something. Don't say it's Rachel's birthday. I hardly have Chris's birthday. <laughs> You think I have more than one dollar to just give to somebody, Linnea? Jesus Christ. Fucking coming in here as a person with a job, begging for a dollar. Unbelievable. <laughs> Garcia wants to take on the bus. <laughs> Amazing. So these bees are doing quite a good job of keeping these guys fed. I like that. I like that a lot. I want more bees. Our bees shall blot out the sun. Okay, so it's cool that this thing goes up to 100 now, but it would be nice if it would speed up a bit as well. Can I be weird, Uncle? You might want to choose a different name if you're going to be an, e uh, an Uncle Reapers. I'll come home to a baby with red roots and red eyeshadow. <laughs> you're not being around my child unsupervised. <laughs> the baby is cooler than you now. Amazing. Can I be the cool aunt who comes by every once a year with presents and also drunk? <laughs> I guess the, I guess that leaves me the role of being the, the guy that uh, they never meet but for some reason leaves them something in their will. I'll take that. What are we fighting about? Do not need to fight? Let's make love, not war. And that's how we got in this situation in the first place. Oh no, it was jokes. Feed the things. Eat the things. Nothing to eat. Oh, I got the cave as well. I keep forgetting about the cave. Uh, you'll be the relative that sends them a crisp five for every birthday and they'll never know who you are, just Neil that sends money. Yeah, that sounds good. Yeah. And every year they'll be like, who's just a Neil? And you'll be like, doesn't even matter. Just take the fiver. Shut up. I'm going to teach your child to sing le 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 lo le like Shakira. Nice. Uh, exactly the way I did it, I assume. Oops, that's the wrong hole. I put it in the wrong hole. La 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 la. Love it. Uh, I'm gonna say kid, the kids' bonds or whatever they're called. Nice, nice. 
Uh, no, I'm not gonna make that joke. I see you made some progress with the ZZ rewards. Yeah, man. I've been buying shit. I got, I got 100 stuffs now. Happy for me. I'm happy for me. Oh, what I'm not happy about is having to get these fucking kookaburra fruit or whatever the fuck they're called. This is getting real fucking old. Easily my least favorite thing. Still never seen a mud ball. Never seen one. <laughs> Already living up to the drunk part. Love it. The fucking absolute useless things. <laughs> Most tips lie, Reapers. But not Shakira's. That's what makes them so special. In a world of lying hips, Shakira's remain honest. Best line of that song. Luckily, my breasts are small and humble, so you don't confuse them with mountains. Absolutely. Absolutely. Possibly. Oh, a mud ball! I found one! I found one! Get out the way, suckers! Mud ball coming through! Where do I take it? Did I get it? No. Where are the things? The thing! The thing! There it is! Kapow! Two. Oh no, five. Okay, that's that's more acceptable. Um I prefer the Moshis. I, I prefer Moshis. Like, I feel like I'm, I actually make progress when I'm doing hers. This, I just don't feel like I'm getting anywhere. I, I prefer Moshis if she didn't have a, a fucking cooldown on it. That's irritating. If I could just keep going in. But I think so far, the, uh, the research one is the only one that's actually reasonable. In terms of getting anywhere with it. Oh look, another one! I'm getting mud balls today, guys! It's happening! Finally! This might make it a little bit smoother, getting mud balls. Uh, Linnea! What are you doing? Was that was that actually justified? I can't tell you how many times my ex-boyfriends confused me with Snowden. Usually, just hold the up button while she's doing it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I figured, figured that one out, Razzy. Figured that one out. I don't want to be here. Ow! Dicks. Uh, I'm not even Mount Pleasant. because you have five white guys on your chest. <laughs> what? Uh, I'm so lost. Maybe I'll just leave at the next convenient opportunity. I'm gonna leave it. Have a good stream, Neil. Okay. Uh, have a great day, Lynn. Uh, I hope everything's going all right. Ow, piss. <laughs> Fuck! I didn't have any jumpy juice. I'm a silly Billy. Uh, 
all that. I was getting mud balls. I was getting mud balls. God damn it. Fool. Prick. Taking it out on him. Oh, my mud balls. Yay! Nice. Right, let's try not to fuck this up again, shall we? Jesus. Unbelievable. First time I was actually making good progress on this game mode. And I screw it up. Because that's what I am. I ruin everything. I'm worth less than this ball of mud. happy he was getting balls and he's been walking his life with the balls for finally drop right i've been waiting for, i've been waiting ages for my balls to drop and i found such a nice little place to put them as well it was going so well i was i was stuffing my balls in that mouth and all the seed was spilling out it was it was finally all coming together I'm just not talking anymore. I'm just completely shut up looking for these fucking flowers. Oh no, 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 no. Uh, this mode game mode has its advantages. <laughs> you can put balls in your mouth. I just did exactly the same thing I did last time. Idiot. Hey, you're cute. Dick. Have a fruit. For everyone interested, the Shrek Fame by Frame Twitter account is up to Shrek winning the wrestling match. Nice! In Duloc. God, it's been years since I've watched Shrek. You should watch it again. I should have uh, I should have watched your narrated view. That would have been good. But I never got around to watching the VOD. Because I'm an idiot. all those cookadubbers. Unbelievable. <sighs> yeah, I guess I'll take the tofu. It's fucking useless, but I guess I'll take the tofu. Yeet. <laughs> I'm biased, but I do recommend... Do you, though? Do you recommend Shrek? This is, this is coming a bit left field here, to be honest with you, Rage.
<laughs> this is controversial and unexpected. <laughs> But yes, Shrek. That is all. I don't think I ever saw the third one. I'm not sure I ever saw the second one, actually. No, I must have seen the second one, because the second one, Donkey and the Dragon, they've got kids, right? I'm pretty sure I've seen that. Fuck, I hate this game mode. It's so slow. I guess that's a good reason not to play it anymore. I saw the third in cinemas, it was a disappointment. Oh, really? That's a shame. Boo! I know. I hate it! I hate it! It's so slow! I, I don't like the monsters you can't repeat immediately, but at least when you're playing it, it's nice and fast. You just blitz through it, get a load of shit, and then fuck off. Boo, Shrek 3 and... There's a fourth one? I didn't even know there was a fourth one. Thanks so much. Thanks so much, Bono. I appreciate it. I appreciate you. There's Shrek Christmas movies as well. Oof. Uh, don't use yourself the service of watching the fourth. I only saw it for the first time a few months ago and it was sad. Oh dear. Is it still the same cast? Or is it one of those weird director to video ones where they change the cast and nothing feels right? Might as well dump some of these, I guess. Just in case. Same cast, it was a cinema release, oh really? You know one that I haven't seen that I really want to see? I've not seen Wreck-It Ralph 2 yet. I really enjoyed Wreck-It Ralph, I thought it was a really good film. I thought it was really good fun. Uh, I mean, it was, it was no Lego movie, let's be honest. But it was good. I liked it. And left me in the same confused state about Sarah Silverman as always. I, n I never, I never know with Sarah Silverman. She's managed, like, she has this perfect balance of just I hate her, but I also really like her, and she just has this perfect balance that leaves her completely in the middle, in my opinion. It's, uh, it's strange. She's an odd one. Uh. I do really appreciate a monster in your chat. I do when he's not being a monster. Why is Bono a monster? We don't talk about that anymore, Rachel.
choice. Let's go and have a look. Hey, the Gordo's here! Hey! I knew a cutie! Hi! Hi! Who's a big Gordo? Who's a big Gordo? Who's a big Gordo? You are, you are, you are, you are a big fat bastard. Are oh, you a big fat bastard?